and my eyes aren't black because I'm tired. My eyes are black because I cannot get this eyeliner off of this eye, dude. I cannot get this eyeliner off this eye. Hold on. This camera's a little greasy. I'm a little grease ball. My camera, the front camera's always greasy. I don't know. I didn't realize I was that greasy of a person. Hello, everybody. Hello. We're back. Back like an ass crack, as they say. Disregard, you know, the residue that's left in my fingers from the nail polish and also how this eye still has a little bit of eyeliner. I can't figure it out. I'm too scared to go in there with the makeup wipe, dude. Oh, how are we doing, people? Back. Back from Los Angeles. Been traveling all day. I'm fucking tired as shit. But I wanted to pop in and say, what's up, guys? Huh? Huh? What up, people? I feel good, dude. That was a great experience. That was dope. Got to meet a lot of people. It was sick. And, uh, yeah, drank probably more than I should have. And then now we're here, baby. Come on. My, I went on a nice little L.A. bender, baby. Yeah. I'm sick and I have an eye infection. Well, I'm sorry for you, you know. If you've been eating too much butt, you know what I'm saying? That happens. When you eat butt, you get eye infections, I think. Get a little poop in there. Anyways, how are we doing, people? What's up? Back from L.A. Almost a 200 kizzy on Twitch, dude. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. Yo, ugly Roblox. Thank you for the three months. You got a shout out. You got a fear and shout out for your fit. Fuck yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Crispy chops. Yeah, I did meet Hassan a couple times. I met him at the very beginning and then I met him at the end when I was, you know, sloshed, which that one was probably less enjoyable. But the beginning was sweet. He walked in and, uh, you know, I talked. He, I was like, obviously, I'm not fucking five seven, dude. Look at this. Look at me right now. I'm not 5'7". That motherfucker is tall. He did like my outfit. That was pretty sweet. Did you meet Selbit? I did meet Selbit. <clears throat> I didn't know like much about Selbit, really. And Selbit and I had several pleasant conversations. So that was pretty sweet. That was pretty sweet. Um, I don't know how I didn't know him because he's like one of the most popular streamers ever. Uh, thank you, everybody, for the subs. Carson, thank you for the five months. Tegan, thank you for the two months. Star Chaser, thank you for the three months. Preesh. Appreciate it. Oh, yeah, I guess we got to talk about the outfit. How was the after party? It was perfect, but the open bar had hands. Let me tell you that, ladies and gentlemen. All right, let's fucking break this down, dude. First of all, good to be back, ladies and gentlemen. Good to be back. Not on my fucking phone in my room. It's pretty sweet. Uh, how are you so red in the photos? See, you guys, I knew you motherfuckers would nitpick like that, dude. I knew you would, all right? I post fit pic, you're like, um, red chest, I knew it would happen, bruh. I knew it would happen. Uh, because I have contact dermatitis, and that fucking thing was itchy, bruh. Because that fucking thing was super itchy. Holy shit, thank you for the 1,500 bits. Foot fog, welcome back, thank you. Hive Nastar, thank you for the four months. Did you and Tar Yummy hang out? Yes, uh, we did. Redneck, white chest. Yeah, that's because it was tied around the neck area. Do you want me to break it down for you? It was tied as fuck around the neck. And I, it got itchy, dude. That's why I got red. Uh, Gracie, thank you for the tier one. Nardusi, thank you for the three months. Yeah, I was mewing the whole time, dude. I straight mogged everybody. It was awesome. I was straight mogging on everyone. <clears throat> Fat Seal, thank you for the one gifted. All right. So here's what we're going to talk about. I guess we'll talk about the outfit first. So first of all... I need a selfie of you and Tara. There is one. I just don't want to post it. I don't want to be like cloud chasing and be like, with the girl, you know? <laughs> like, I didn't want to, I don't know. You should probably have your likes on TikTok. They are. And it's all boobs. It's all videos of boobs, you know? But anyways, the outfit. Allie Mass, thank you for the three months. So, I guess maybe I'll pull up pictures of the outfit. Surely you guys have seen it already. But if you, you know, have been living under a fucking rock, dude... This is what I wore, okay? So I had this little lace thing. TikTok people, you can't see this, but you've probably seen the TikTok. Uh, little lace thing, leather jacket, Dolce & Gabbana. That suit was like $10,000. <laughs> it was fucking nuts. I only got it because my manager is like a contact with Dolce & Gabbana. And they were like, we love your dick jokes on you know Instagram Reels. I was like, thank you very much. And then I went to the place... And then I tried it all on, and they were... I am I was terrified wearing that thing. Because, like, if I spill a drink on a $10,000 suit, 
I'm fu- I got to sell my house or something. Like I'm fucked. There's no chance in hell that I can recover from that. Um, thank you, Chocolate Frosty, for the seven months. Chaz Dingle, thank you for the tier one sub. Hey, what up, Evan? Hope you made it back home. I bet you felt like a million bucks. I did, dude. I felt sexy in that thing until my rash started acting up, dude. That shit was... Also, okay, I'm all over the place right now because I'm exhausted. But when I put on that lace shit, I was like, there is not a chance in hell I wear this. There's no way, dude. There's no way I wear this lace outfit. And then I tried the other ones on and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do it, baby. And then I did it. And luckily, the leather blazer covered my nips, so it didn't really matter, you know? It's not like my nips were out. Then that might have been a problem. Austin Show said he wished he wore your fit. Nice, dude. Yeah, he would have looked good in it. He's more jacked than I am, but who wore it? Uh, Me, this guy right here. Arguably the best dressed, you know? Probably not. Not with the rash, but Pixar didn't happen. I just showed you guys the picture. <laughs> it's also on every social media that I... Uh, uh. And then here's a little fun one of me sitting on the couch and I'm smiling and it was great. Um, yeah, let me think. Let me rack my brain on this shit. Okay, so we did. I met a shit ton of people and it was fucking awesome. It was a great, it was a great um, trip, dude. <clears throat> let me think. Were you wearing nip covers? No, I wasn't wearing pasties. I was letting the nipples fly, brother man. Um, I'm trying to, let me, let me think through everybody I met. And everybody was also super fucking cool. I thought like the big streamers might be like conversation with you is beneath me. Um, but no one was like that. Everyone is cool as shit. Like literally everybody I met was fucking awesome. And also I feel like it takes the awkwardness out of it when you meet someone that you know from online. Cause it's almost like, you know, them, your mic on TikTok isn't working. Oh. Sounds like you're underwater. Is it working now? Hello? What are your thoughts on Michelle Obama? She fucking ruined school lunch. Poon Raccoon, thank you for the two months. It doesn't matter. We'll let it. I don't know if this is better or not, but whatevs. Anyways, what was I talking about? Okay, so here we go. Who did I meet? Starting from the beginning. Jake and I hung out. Jake and Johnny. Cool as shit. Why do you look like you're wearing eyeliner? Because I fucking am, bruh. Because I am wearing eyeliner. I couldn't get it off. Anyways, here we go. Running through my whole trip. Got there on Wednesday. Hung out with Jake and Johnny. Fucking cool ass motherfucking guys, dude. Sweet ass dudes. Taro's there for a second. Got to see her. Cool girl. Cool gal. Tiny gal. Tiny chick. She's like a little hobbit person. Tara is like fucking 4'10 or something. It was crazy. It made me feel awesome. I was like, yeah. Maybe I am 6'7". For where she sits, you know. Chaz Dingle, thank you for the one gifted. So she was cool. Yeah, Hobbit. I mean, a good looking Hobbit, but like a just a tiny little tiny person. So met them. Cool ass people. Filmed some video. Me and Jake did that stream. And then me and Johnny did that stream the other day. Uh, Clay, thank you for the prime sub. Tubbo, me tip... Tibbo, me, Tubbo, and Nikki got dinner one night. Cool ass motherfucking people. I'm just gonna say that for everybody. Everybody I met was cool. The Nikki was cool as hell. Uh, we talked about that like she kind of made that little, you know, that little minor joke in her speech, and she was like bringing that up. She was like bringing it up on how she wanted to do something like that, and I was like, you got to, you got to. But my pitch was a little bit more insane than hers. Hers was. Hers was pretty tame. I was like, you should say, like, you know, hopefully none of these guys are pedophiles, right? I got my eye on you, dude, and then pick somebody out. But I guess that wouldn't have fly. <laughs> that wouldn't have flown very well. So, you know, she did not do that one. But she did at least mention it a little bit. So she was cool. Tubbo's cool as shit. Young. I didn't know Tubbo was 20. I thought it was, like, my age. Um, British. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what, uh, oh yeah, her joke isn't flying on Twitter. Yeah, dream Twitter. Me when a, you know, a thousand 14 year olds are mad at me. What are you going to do, fight me or something? I guess that's like the perfect play. If a 14 year old tries to fight you, you can't really hit him back because they'll be like, you know, minors can't hit a minor, whatever, you know? 
<laughs> Toasty's weird. Thank you for the one gifted. Appreciate it. All right, let me continue through this. Jake and I went out a bunch. Uh, Jake and Johnny and I hung out a pretty good bit. And then Tara was there in and out. Um, the actual awards, I met a shitload of people. Let me see. Let me see. Hannah was there. JC was there. Uh, who else did I meet? I met Hassan at the very beginning. He walked in and I was like, you remember me, dude. You listen to my clips and your entire chat hated my clips. Hmm? And we talked about the Yuval thing where I was 5'7". And he's like, yeah, that's how I found out about you. I was like, yeah, it sucks. That's like a quarter of my audience is just like, they came in from Yuval. And they're like, did you know that you're 5'7"? Idiot. And then some of them stuck around. I was like, sweet. Prezo. <clears throat> Prezo fucking rocks. Finally got to be a Prezo in person. Prezo is so funny. Uh, your, your earbud mic is going crazy on your shirt. Oh, I have the wrong one plugged in. That's why it sounds horrible. Sorry, TikTok people. My bad. Please tell me you meant Austin Show. Austin Show was the last person I met. And it was the end of the night. So, like, at the after party. So, by that point, you know, it was like, Austin Show. Oh, my God. You're my favorite gay streamer. I don't think I said that specifically. But I was pretty slam boned. So, I'm sure it was. I'm sure it was like, <laughs> you know. I'm sure I wasn't very charming, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure he wasn't like, wow, that was a really respectable guy. Uh, the after party was cool. It was in the same venue. Ludwig, saw Ludwig. Uh, Valkyrie was in the vicinity, but I got nervous, and I did not talk to her, really. Um, I see the hickey comments. It is a zit. It is a zit. Then I covered up with makeup. That's another thing I want to talk about. I'll talk about that later. Uh, I want to get through all the people I met. Let's see. Mm, Tara, Jake and Johnny, Prezzo. Uh, who else? I met the other Rising Star nominees. Fucking cool as hell. Well, not Nora, the one that won, ironically enough. Uh, met Mari, met uh, Chibley, cool people, dude. And I'm sure I met, and I met a bunch of other people. Ted was like in the vicinity. We didn't like have a one on one conversation. Ted Nivison. Let's see. Who else? Who else? Emma Longevin. I think that's how you say her last name. Cool girl. Queso was not there, unfortunately. That was going to be sweet as hell. Oh, yeah, the quackity pick? Dude. So for those of you who don't know, let me pull up the picture and show you guys. So, <laughs> so I tweeted this picture out, like, when it happened. And I was like, hell motherfucking yeah, dude. And, you know, I'm, like, hammered at this point. And I'm like... <laughs> In the moment, I was like, fuck yeah, that's sweet as shit. I look fantastic, but I don't. I look awful, and my eyes are red, and I'm like pale as hell. But by God, I still put it on Instagram because I'm like, I can't pass up this opportunity, you know? I mean, come on. I mean, Jesus Christ. Yeah, uh, Queso wasn't there. Couldn't get on the plane, guys. I'm leaning into it, you know? Everyone does it. I might as well have some fun as well, you know? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, what else, who else, who else, what else, hmm, I mean, I met plenty, plenty of, like, Twitch staff, Dan Clancy I met, the CEO, thank you for the 500 bits, congrats, on uh, this awards, hope you had fun, today is my 20th birthday, happy 20th, appreciate it, as you tap quackity, I hope that is a typo, and you meant to say talk to quackity, yeah, I did, for a little bit, um, what did you think of QT's monologue? I thought it was good. I think it's very fucking difficult to do like a comedy monologue at something like that. But I think, I think it was pretty well done as far as, you know, if you have seen any other award show where they have to like roast the people, it's usually always pretty like, mm, you know, I thought she had some, I thought she had some zingers in there, you know, she was going for the Ricky Gervais Golden Globes kind of deal, you know, give us your speech. Oh yeah. That was pretty embarrassing too, is that I wrote a whole speech also, I didn't know if I'd be able to say, like, fuck and shit and bitch and stuff. Like, I didn't know if it would be, like, if I could be PG-13. I guess that's more R-rated. So, um, I, I didn't put that in the winning speech. And then I saw everyone is cursing a bunch. So, I was like, okay. I came up with some jokes on the fly. But jokes on the fly, though, would never see the light of day anymore because I lost. <sighs> no, I don't care that much. Nora's deserving, so shout out Nora. A lot of people said robbed, but it was, you know, my audience saying robbed, you know. Like, if I had won, everyone else's audience would have been, like, robbed, you know. 
it makes sense. It makes sense. So shout out her. Never got to meet her, but you know, would have been cool to win. But also just being there was sweet. You know, it would have been more or less the same experience. I would have gotten maybe some more likes on Instagram and Twitter, and that's about it. You know. <laughs> oh man, what else do I want to talk about? Oh yeah, the makeup. So I was wearing makeup. Listen to this shit, dude. So I was breaking out, and I'm still kind of breaking out, as you can see. So I was breaking out pretty bad right before the event. And I was like, okay, hold on, let me read this first time chat. I'm new here, is it okay to touch myself to you? Go nuts, man, you know, whatever. Um, I'm not seeing it, so do what you want. Uh, But (laughs) I had zits on my jaw, and I was like, okay, well, I'll just do like a little cover-up action. And apparently, you can't hire makeup people to just do cover up act like cover up stuff. So this dude came and he gave me just like full face, not like glam or anything, but like foundation. It was very well done, but like I've never fucking put makeup on my face. And a lot of you people that are like, mm, um, that's zesty. Um, no, that's a little uh what are you, a zest fest? Fucking half the guys there were wear makeup, dude. Do you know what I'm talking about? You have no fucking idea. All right. But yeah. Did you see a thirst trap of you on TikTok? I mean, I've seen plenty of them, you know. But, yeah, the makeup was good at the beginning. But then, at the end, you know, I'm sweating and shit and, like, touching my face and all that shit. And I didn't wear lipstick. Also, that picture was edited to, like, the picture was edited. I guess it was, the saturation was up, so people thought I was wearing lipstick. I wasn't fucking wearing lipstick. But even if I was, it would have been cool, dude. I should have just really leaned into it. I was afraid when he did the makeup, I would come out as like, you know, James Charles or something. But it was pretty subtle. Living Dead Girl, thank you for the two months. But yeah, the fit was awesome. Other than it was like itchy, but Shanna, Dolce & Gabbana. I've never worn anything that expensive in my fucking life, dude. That was crazy. I've never like worn leather. I felt sick as hell. I got so many compliments. Everyone was like, wow, you look so good. Oh, yeah, the interview. I did an interview. People were like messaging me being like, where was your interview? I did an interview. And it was goddamn good, dude. I had some zingers, okay? I don't know why I wasn't aired. They switched my interviewee last minute, so maybe that's why. But um, I had some zingers, bro. I had some zingers. I was like, <clears throat> you know, you guys know me. You guys know me. You know my quick quips and things. So, yeah. Recreate it? Yeah, let me just think of what I said. No, I forget everything that comes out of my mouth as soon as it exits, you know? You'll hear some zingers. I mean, that's this whole stream, dude. Just straight zingers. Thanks for the galaxy on TikTok. Whatever that means. Still don't know. Mayonator, thank you for the five months. Izzy, thank you for the two months. Appreciate it. Yo, 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 yo. I'm trying to think of mm, what else happened. Tara was, Tara showed up on Sunday. I saw Tara on Wednesday. I saw Tara on Sunday for longer. So I saw her at the beginning and the end. And then I saw everybody in the stream rewards. And then, yeah, it was sweet, dude. It was a good time. Everyone was fucking cool. Everyone was cool. The pic of me and Tara, it's just like a selfie of us together. Ghetto soup. It's on my phone. I don't have it on my computer. Uh, what did you think of LA? I guess I could talk about LA. Um, here's the thing about LA. Why the fucking shit is everything in Los Angeles in like a cage, dude? It's in a fucking, I want to get deodorant. It's in a goddamn cage. Who interviewed you? Uh, Will Neff did. Oh, someone shit in the urinal at the streamer awards. What? It was me. All right. Don't tell anybody, but I took a big shit in the urinal and I flooded the bathroom, and I deleted the security cam footage, okay? And I deleted it. Yeah, someone pooped in the urinal. Don't know who it was. Maybe it was somebody that had to go really bad and all the stalls are full, you know? Okay, what about this, QT Cinderella? You're gonna have an open bar, I'm gonna shit in the urinal, okay? One plus one equals two, right? No, I didn't shit in the urinal. Hopefully, I don't incriminate myself. I did not shit in the urinal. Uh, Big man, thank you for the prime sub. But, you know, I did go in there, and it was, like, flooded. And then you had to, like, go through, like, a maze 
and solve like three riddles to get to the other bathroom. Oh, that's something else I could talk about, I guess. Um, so because someone shit the urinal and flooded the toilet, we, you had to like go to general admission, you know, where the commoners stayed. No, <laughs> I, you know, I'm big time LA now, you know, no, I'm kidding. Uh, you had to go up to general admission where like, you know, the upper balcony and stuff is. And, you know, I went over there, peed, all that stuff, came back down, forgot my VIP wristband that says that I am like, <laughs> you know, on the floor and a streamer that got nominated. So <laughs> the security was like, no, dude, what are you fucking doing? I was like, no, I'm in there. I'm in there. I swear to God. Why do you think I'll be wearing this shit if I'm not in there? I'm literally at that table. And he was like, nope. No, 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 no. I was like, dude, please. And then like Ms. Kiff and Bryce Up, shout out to the boy. Um, yeah, I'm not wearing a 10K Dulce, Dulce and Gabbana suit to sit in a general admission. Are you kidding me? One that I didn't pay for? Anyways, Ms. Kiff and Bryce Up came out and they were like, he's good. We saw him. And I was like, yes. So let me in. Uh, 355 bits. Thank you. The fit was so hard. Thank you, Ghetto Soup. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yup. 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 What's your favorite historical tragedy? I'll circle back to that after I, you know, give my synopsis of my LA trip. You remind me of Shaq. I get that a lot, actually. Uh, Frigid GF. Thank you for the tier one six months in advance. Appreciate it. So, okay, met Dan Clancy. Twitch CEO, um, for some reason, like my ego was like, he's probably going to know who I am, Loki, you know, he's probably going to know who I am. And, you know, I met him and he was like, who are you? Like, what do you do? Are you streaming? I was like, fuck, God damn it. <laughs> and then I met him <laughs> and then I met him. I saw him again at the streamer awards. That was like the, you know, uh, that was at the happy hour. Brick, thank you for the seven months. And then at the stream rewards, I was like, he totally remembers me. I probably made a great impression. He was like, we met, right? I was like, God, double shit. God damn it. <laughs> so, yeah. But it was cool. Was it scary? No, no. Quite the opposite, actually. I love that shit. Like, I was so excited to just meet people. I don't really get, like, weird around, like, like, I don't know. I, I don't really get weird around, like, fame famous people i don't know because i i like to think of myself in the same lane as like streamers other than like valkyrie maybe that was one i was a little nervous about but i was just super excited to meet people hopping around talking to everybody it was a good time i really enjoyed it thank you for the 100 bits griv appreciate it if you could have fought anyone there uh probably hassan probably just to prove myself you know because people would think it would be like obviously he'd win but no, he doesn't know the tricks I got up my sleeve. It's a gun. No, I don't know. <laughs> I wouldn't have fought anyone there. I was making that point earlier. Everyone is cool as shit, dude. Everyone is cool as shit. Literally, ev there was not one person I met that w like sucked. Everyone was cool as hell. Every single person I met was cool as shit. It was awesome. Um, so like people that I knew of... Or people that I was friends with online. Mr. Cyanide, think of the prime sub. I got cyanide poisoning one time. I guess we could talk about that later. Um, yeah, everyone I met. People I didn't know at all. Very cool. Also, yeah. It was sweet. First stream, hello. Good to have you. Name drop an asshole. There was no asshole. Not that I could think of. Not that I can think of. You look so good in the shirt. Thank you. Please meow for us? No, there will be no meowing. At least not tonight. Will you go to LA again? Were you recognized? I was recognized out. Oh my God, dude. I guess I could tell this story. So me and Jake went out twice. And, you know, it's just me and him. So everyone's coming up to him and being like, Oh my God, Jake Weber, I love you. And like, no one's saying shit to me. I'm like, all right, dude. Okay. And then finally one person was like, Hands of L, I love your stuff. I was like, that's right, motherfucker. Uh. Also, Jake wore these platforms that made him like, you know, as tall as hell. We're the same height, okay? And he wore platforms that made him like the tallest person on earth. Jaboob. Thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it. 
Preach, I'm back, I'm back, baby. I'm back. Saw your TikTok, Johnny Gilbert, with a story on that. I don't know. We're moots, and I was in LA. Said, what's up? LA traffic sucks. Anywhere, like, I don't know how people live in LA. I don't understand. Moist slaps, think of the tier once up. I don't get it. The traffic it blows. Everyone's spread apart. Like, every neighborhood is like an hour away. La Rizzle, think of the three months. Appreciate it. Your TikTok stream is faster than your Twitch. Thank you for that piece of information. I don't know what to do with that at all, but I appreciate it. Um, let me try and let me try and think. I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh yeah, everyone I met in LA was an, an aspiring actor of some sort. Like I would get in the Uber, and the driver would be like, "Hello, here's my story," and I'm like, "All right." Okay, and they're like, here's the films that I've been in and the work that I've done. And I'm like, excellent, that's sweet. <laughs> I appreciate it, you know? Oh, is it ad time? Yeah. Yeah, I know, ads, bro. Why are there subs saying ads? <laughs> I always hear the wildest stories from L.A. I gotta go one day. There wasn't anything that wild. Can I get a recap? I did just give the recap. I guess I could give a recap of a recap. You know? If you meow, I will sub. I don't need to sub that bad. I'm not going to meow for you. That's not happening. Not happening. 30 ads. Are you serious? You, Katia. Thank you for the one gifted bonk knee. Thank you for the prime sub. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How was Hassan? Hassan was cool as hell, man. Hassan was cool. Cool dude. Cool guy. Tall guy. I, when I met him, I was like, wow, you're a lot shorter than I thought you would be. And he was like, what? I was like, oh, that was, I was joking. I was kidding. <laughs> he was like, really? No one ever says that. I was like, yeah, I was being sarcastic. You're fucking tall as shit, dude. Um, who all did you meet? I did just talk about it. Gil Nut, think of the prime sub. Um, but I guess I'll, you know. Tara, Jake, Johnny. Nikki, Tubbo, were the people that I like hung out with. And then, you know, at the Stream Rewards, Prezzo, Austin Show, Will Neff, Hassan, all the Rising Star people, and Quackity. Oh, yeah, Hannah. Hannah, who I'm good friends with. When are you collabing with Joe Bart? Um, next. Is it next week? We're in an event together sometime soon. Anyways, I don't want the whole recap to just be me being like, here are the fucking famous people that I met. Yeah. So basically, I'm the shit, you know? Because it wasn't like, you know, well, other than the people that I actively hung out with, <laughs> we just had a conversation and that was about it, you know? But like Nikki and Tubbo and Jake and Johnny and Tara and all them were like hanging out. I'm fried, baby. Thank you for the one gifted Sal Piz. Thank you for the nine months. Uh, you're schizophrenic? Maybe. I don't know. Are you wearing two sets of headphones? I am indeed. Did you film a YouTube video with him? Yes, I did. You look like a redhead. I am a redhead. You know, red, ginger adjacent. I'm not like the disgusting orange redhead. I mean, gross. That's disgusting. Um. Uh, but yeah, dude. It was sweet. It was sweet. It was a great experience. Yeah, QT Cinderella. I didn't get to meet her, but she uh, put on a fucking fantastic event. And it was dope to be a part of, man. It was sweet as hell. Hooves, thank you for the dollar. Me and my dad laugh at your streams. Keep it up, handsome fella. Ooh, I should talk about that. My parents watched the streamer awards, dude. My parents watched the streamer awards because that's like the only thing they could see and be like, hooray, we're happy for our son. So they were watching my section, but shortly before my section was, um, oh, what was it? It was the one that Soda Poppin' won. And his video was like, eat shit, you fucking piece of shit, fuck you. And I was like, my parents are going to hate all that cursing. And then QT's monologue, I was like, Jesus Christ, <laughs> my parents are going to hate this. Oh, man, they probably muted it until they saw my face. And then, but yeah, you know, I got a whack, I got a... I got a wild, you know, 30 seconds of screen time. That was pretty sweet. Mmm. Mmm. Uh. Uh. I was told to come here to learn about sex. Is that true? Well, oh, 
Don't. Ah, I can't give anything away yet. Well, that sounds crazy. That makes it sound like something it isn't. Never, it's going to be very hard to explain. <laughs> Never mind. Just forget I said anything, you know? Forget I said anything. Saw you vibing to freestyle too. Oh, you mean the Harry Mack freestyle? That was crazy. I didn't realize it was off the dome until like... um. Yeah, there's a Rose Toy sponsor, ladies and gentlemen. Rose Toy sponsor. Sorry. I hate to go ahead and spoil it, but... You know, since I went big time in L.A., Rose Toy <laughs> reached out to me. No, that's not it. But there is something. We'll talk about it later. Um, anyways, do you lose your virginity in L.A.? No, still, you know. I mean, I, I didn't get married in L.A., so. You can't have sex without being married. Do you understand what I'm saying? Out of wedlock, you know what happens. You explode. Uh, Clara something. Sierra Phoenix. Thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it. I think that's everything. I think I talked about everything. My parents. I talked about the people I met. Braves fan. Thank you for the three months. Um, yeah, I think I talked about everything. Thank you for the hundred bits. Can't spoil the ending to sex. I hear the plot is good. And it ends with a twist. It does indeed. Oh, cyanide poisoning? I feel like I've talked about that a lot on stream, but we have new people. Um, I'll make it short, but one time I ate so many almonds that I gave myself cyanide poisoning. There's like, there's like a little bit of cyanide in every almond. And if you eat a lot of them, you will go to the hospital for cyanide poisoning. The, the amount of cyanide in an almond is not harmful to a human. Unless you eat a shitload of almonds. You know what I'm saying? Pebbles, thank you for the tier ones up. Um, I did eat a pound of almonds. I ate a pound. I ate an entire... I ate half a two-pound bag of almonds. And... I had to go to the hospital. I thought my appendix burst. I thought I had appendicitis or something. And I was crying. And my stomach was killing me. Why was so many? I was hungry, dude. I didn't know there was poison in almonds. Why would they make it like that? Pebbles, thank you for the 100 bits. Um, yeah, I went to the hospital. And I was in a wheelchair. But what if someone got in a car accident and got their legs cut off? And they're like, sorry, we gave the wheelchair to the almond guy. You know? Uh, so I went and saw the doctor and he was like, what did you eat today? And I was like, eggs and a sandwich and some almonds and dinner. And he was like, how many almonds? I was like, like a pound. He was like, what the fuck? <laughs> He's like, you poisoned yourself. I was like, oh, and it was $700 to pump your stomach. So my mom was like, fuck you. No, that's not happening at all. Thank you for the 400 bits. Uh, pebbles. Appreciate you, dude. Are you actually a virgin with free? Yes. I'm saving myself to a marriage. I don't know what you guys understand. I'm a devout Catholic, a devout Christian boy. Those are like the same thing, I think. I just spit everywhere. Uh, if you give us the teddy bear name, I'll drop a sub. It's uh, Bart, right? Didn't we establish that already? Bart. I can't quite remember. All right. Nim, 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 nim. Nim, 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 nim. But yeah, L.A. was sweet. L.A. was dope. It was awesome. I feel like I keep talking in circles. I'm saying the same stuff. I'm very tired. I'm trying to think of... Oh, I almost missed my flight. That was something that happened. Nemesis. This is a funny story. Nemesis, thank you for the one gifted. So I... <laughs> I meant... Um, <laughs> so I went to the wrong terminal by accident. And then I had to wait for the the terminal like truck to come and pick me up and take me to the other terminal. So, you know, that took forever. And then the TSA line was long as shit. My takeoff departure was 715. Did you win anything at the awards? Uh, no, dude, stop bringing it up. I lost. <sighs> you guys are just ripping open a scab. And you're never going to let it heal. Cherry, thank you for the tier ones up. Um, but anyway, so I had to wait to get to this terminal. TSA line was long. Departure was 7.15 a.m. I finally get through TSA at um, 7, 7, 10. Like, I get to the gate at 7.10. My boarding time ended at, like, 6.55. So, no, usually they don't let you on the plane. And I was like, man... You have to let me on here. I was like, you absolutely have to let me on this flight. I'm begging you, dude. 
I'm begging you, lady, please. I was like, I have a, uh, I was like, I have a fitting with Dolce and Gabbana, and she was like, You have a Dolce and Gabbana fitting? You're flying Southwest Airlines? There's no way. That's true. I was like, I promise, I'm not making it up. Please get me on this flight. <laughs> she was like, You're flying. This flight was a hundred and twenty dollars. <laughs> I'm like, Please. And they and they checked and they checked and they got me on. I was the last person on the flight, obviously. And I was also the last seat. There were no seats left except for one inside of the very bag. The Crusader, they give it to tier one uh, for two months. Appreciate it. What did you give up for Lent? Um, what did I give up for Lent? Uh, head from your mother, dude. It was happening too often. It was happening all the time, every day. That wasn't clever, but my brain is working very slow right now. I could have come up with something funny there. There was definitely a good bit there. But I just defaulted to, you know, the classic your mom thing. So my bad on that. There's a clever thing there. Ask me that question again in about 30 minutes. I could I could figure something out, you know? Oh, man. Yeah, the awkward walk to the back. Yeah, they were getting ready to take off. And I'm like, everybody. Oh, I'm here, you know? I'm here. Are you even Catholic? No. I don't know what the fucking Pope does, dude. I don't even... What is the Pope? I don't even know what the Pope is at all. I don't know who the Pope is or what he does. Um, other than, like, you know, the kid stuff. That's the only thing I've heard about the Pope. I haven't heard about his, you know, actions for Christ or whatever. I've only heard about stuff with kids. You know what I'm saying? I will say I always thought that was weird that... um. Because Catholics have, like, confessional. So you have to go to this guy and be like, and everything you do, you just got to be like, Lord, forgive me. You know, I keep, you know, having sex or something. And he's like, really? Tell me a little bit more about that. And he's like, <laughs> he's like describe her body. And the Pope's like, <laughs> you know, like, you just got to confess. And they're asking for details. They're like, hmm. Tell me more about this. Fat something whips. Thank you for the three months. Appreciate it. You said you were Catholic. I'm confused. Okay, let me clear that up for you. I was lying. I'm not Catholic. <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? Do I sound Catholic? Come on. <laughs> I will say, I find most people that are Catholics, you know, they usually leave the faith. Anybody that grew up in, like, Catholic school, you know, they usually... Leave the faith. Am I tripping or were you live this afternoon? I was not. I was on a plane this afternoon. Coming back here. Bruh. Did you get a little tan? I don't like a sickly. Well, that's because I was wearing makeup. And okay, dick bag. What are you talking? You guys love doing that. You're like, you looked like a sick piece of shit. And your skin was red and I hate you. So observant. Too observant. All right. I'm going to start being observant. Being observant to y'all motherfuckers, dude. I'm going to find your profiles. I'm going to be like, interesting, you have a zit on your forehead. Did you know this? Cyclops? You know that big, you know about that big giant zit on your forehead, dude? Snippity man, thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. La da 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 da. La da da. No, I have a, you know, degrading thing, so keep doing it. It's fine with me. Uh, the motorboat captain, thank you for the prime sub. It is unfortunate that I did not give my speech. That would have been sweet. Uh, mainly because I'm, you know, horny for screen time. That was about it. That was about it. No, I'm not giving you guys a speech now. No. No, dude. You know how embarrassing that is? It's only an in-the-moment thing. In-the-moment thing, dude. Whew. I think that wraps up the L.A. trip. Met a lot of people. Had a good time. I guess I could go through the images one more time. Um, we've already looked at this one, which is a fucking nightmare of a picture. Nightmare of a picture. <laughs> this, this is when I saw him again. I saw him at the beginning, like I said earlier, and then I was like, okay, let's make a funny face in this one. And then, you know, I was, you know, I was too drunk to like make it also look good. He looks fantastic. He makes me look worse. You know, I should have made this dumbass face. Um, 
Prezzo, dope as hell, dude. Dude, low key. I may have only gotten 30 seconds of screen time, but like that little snippet, I made sure to make the most of that. I made sure to make the most of the 30 seconds. I was doing a lot of stuff with my hands and stuff. I was like, uh, check me out, people. Hey, come on. <laughs> Straight mogging, bruh. Straight mogging that thing. NY something. Thank you for the prime sub. Yeah. This is when the rash first started happening. I was like, fuck. It was so tight around the neck, dude. It was so tight around the neck. It was so red. You can't see this on TikTok, people. But the outfit is sweet as hell, dude. It's disgusting how much things cost. Shout out Dolce and Gabbana for reals. Okay, that was the first time I went over their house. We got to come up with something different other than keep going, I'm almost finished. I feel like that's so overused. Like, I get it, dude. You're jaying off, you know? Come up with a more creative way to say it. <laughs> or it's all over the screen or something. I'm just trying to see in the same... I'm trying to see in the same chance, you know? You can do that, if you so please. You know, it's free country, but... Be a little bit more clever about it, you know? <laughs> Feels good to be back, ladies and gentlemen. Did you sound like yourself or did you get help? Well, I went to the Dolce & Gabbana, like, fitting. And they helped me out. Um... There's like a whole vlog that's coming about that. So you guys will see the whole creative process. It was awesome. It was a good time. Are we playing games or just chatting today? We are playing games. I'm going to, you know, I didn't have anything planned because I didn't know if I was going to stream today. Um, so I'm going to play the Minecraft boob mod. You guys love the Minecraft boob mod, right? Don't you guys love the Minecraft boob mod? We're doing that. We're doing the Minecraft boob mod. It's going to be awesome. And you guys can ask me questions, and we can talk, and it's going to be awesome. Minecraft is an easy one to just chat with y'all. And, you know, it's where most of my... For some reason, the TikToks that do well have Minecraft at the bottom. So, you know, maybe we'll get some clips or something. And then people will be like, are you wearing eyeliner? <laughs> I'll be like, yes. Lydia, thank you for the five months. Thank you. Thoughts on the Drake leaks? That happened like two weeks ago, dude. I'm, I've only looked at them every day. I mean, Jesus Christ. Your mom's pimp. Thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it. Remember that clip where you said normalized white people getting cornrows? I saw that video and went to my local barber and got cornrows. You want to see them? Sure. Dude, what if I had pulled up to the streamer awards with cornrows? There's no way that I would have gotten over <laughs> I just don't tell anybody. <laughs> and I have cornrows. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, dude. That would have been sweet. Maybe I would have gotten the win. Yeah, I'm sure QT Cinderella would have loved that. Would I have gotten canceled for that? That's not cancelable. <laughs> they just... The, the camera's on me for a split second. They're like, holy shit. Holy God. We can't do that. We can't. How is that cancelable? White people get cornrows. White people have gotten cornrows before. And dreads. Justin Bieber. Who else? They have. They didn't get can Justin Bieber is doing great right now, you know? Yeah, my hair would fall out. There's no way. Uh, you said you would do an oil upstream and hit 200K. You're almost there. I will do an oil upstream. It will happen if I hit 200K. You know? Please shut the fuck up. Uh, no! <laughs> no! If I want to pop out of the streamer awards with cornrows, I damn well will. But I didn't want to, so I didn't. You know? Um, so... <laughs> Uh, white boy Carl, perfect example, dude. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I didn't get canceled at the stream rewards. Nikki Niachu got canceled, okay, for just saying the word minor. Like it's what there wasn't even really like a, it wasn't crazy at all. It was just like, and also who's to say it wasn't M I N E R, huh? You know what I'm saying? For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, Nikki was like, uh, um, giving the Minecraft of streamer of the year award. Mad Cretan, thank you for the 100 bits. Marissa, thank you for the one gifted. And she said, uh, I can't remember the exact verbiage, but it was like, you know. She was like, here's the 
minor, I mean Minecraft, you know, streamer of the year. And it was supposed to be like a little jab because traditionally Minecraft streamers don't have a good track record when it comes to not talking to minors, right? You know, I mean, we'll just say it <laughs> because traditionally, yeah. And, you know, I guess people thought, you know, Dream Twitter was like, how could you say this? Oh, my God. Holy shit. I saw someone tweet, like, the one that I saw that got the most likes was like, um, you can never joke about something like this. Are you out of your fucking mind, dude? Were you not on Twitter when all that dream shit was happening? That was all the fucking... What are you talking about? You could never joke about it. Never? Are you crazy? Yes, you can, dude. And everyone did forever, you know? I don't know. I don't know. But, like, she didn't call anyone out specifically. It was just, like, dream Twitter. I guess, you know, kind of internalize that, I guess. I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, I now realize all the Minecraft YouTubers I used to love when I was a kid probably would love me, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, QT Cinderella had her little jab at dream. And, you know, no one gave her shit. You know what I'm saying? She had a little dream jab. Anyways, kind of look like Dream's brother. Mods, push that guy into oncoming traffic. No, I'm kidding. I kind of get it. We both have poofy hair and stuff and play Minecraft and all the good stuff. <laughs> you should have won. I, You know, it would have been sweet. It would have been sweet. Oh, we pinned that chat. Okay. <laughs> we pinned the chat. <laughs> Maybe next year. Well, see, here's another thing I want to talk about. I will play Minecraft right now. I will do the ceremonial move from my main monitor to my second monitor. Here we go. Bo -bo 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 Boing. Let me see if there's any more pictures I wanted to go through. I'm all over the place because I'm so fucking tired right now. Long day of travel. Long day of travel. Dude, I was sitting in the middle seat, and I have the bladder of, like, a schoolgirl. So... Um, uh, Miss Parker, they give you the 11 months. And this lady was next to me trying to sleep and I kept having to go and pee. And I was like, I am so sorry. <laughs> I went, up, I went up like three times and I had to be like, I'm so sorry. Like she was so upset. So upset. Ooh, you know what I didn't talk about? Ooh, I know what I could talk about. My Airbnb. Ooh, I'll talk about my Airbnb. And then we're done talking about the trip. Um, I guess we'll continue on through these pictures. We already, this was at the fitting. Present, okay, this is at the fitting as well. That was me blowing a little kiss. Me looking awesome. Me looking sick as fuck. You know, pretty obviously in makeup, but still looking sick as fuck. You know, girls wear makeup and they look sick. Some guys wear makeup and they look pretty sick, you know. It's a very subtle, it's a very subtle look. All right. I think that's it. Oh, these are just the same. Oh, yeah. You guys didn't see this one. Ooh, here's an unreleased one. Oh, yeah. Me sitting down on the couch. So they had this casting couch here, which was pretty sweet. Um, <laughs> they had the casting couch here. We saw that. Did I show it on stream, I guess? Uh, Huntour, thank you for the Prime sub, appreciate it. Why did you keep that top if it was tight? Uh, cause it looks fucking sick as hell, dude. That's why. Beauty is pain. Silly. Alright, I'm gonna talk about the, uh, Airbnb. And then I'm gonna pee and we're gonna play Minecraft. But the Minecraft boob mod, okay? And we're still just gonna chat and stuff. He's frozen. Um, me when my internet is awful. Or you when your internet is awful, actually, is what I meant to say. Ugh. Clean up all my pants. Yep. Anyways. Uh, Airbnb. Let me first load up this Minecraft thing. So. I. Stayed at this Airbnb. And the pictures looked sweet, and the pictures looked awesome, and I was like, holy shit, dude, it's going down. Like, I got such a good deal. Like, I totally finessed the system 
It was very dope. Did you win an award? You guys got to stop asking me that, dude. Because every time you ask me that, it's like taking a knife to a healing wound. <laughs> Anyways, um, so, you know, I was like, fantastic. This is a great deal. It's a very nice room. And then I get there, and there's black mold in the ceiling. And I'm like, fantastic. And it's also just a room. It's not a house. Well, it is a house, but it's a room in a house. So they took a room in a house, and then they made it its own room. So they put a toilet in there and, like, an oven and a fridge. But the problem with having your bathroom in your bedroom is you shit where you sleep. You know what I'm saying? The only thing separating me from my shit in the toilet was a foldable wall. Murder Eva. Eva, thank you for the tier one, three months in advance. So... You know, I can you recap the trip? I was wiping off my keyboard. No. <laughs> so if I shit, right, and I just walk five feet to the bed, my whole room smells like shit now. So that was cool. And there was also mold in the ceiling, so that was also cool. Um, and everything was a little bit wet. Everything was a little bit damp. Everything was weirdly damp for some reason. Like I would... <laughs> Like, when I got in there, I would, like, lay in bed, and the sheets would be a little bit wet. And I'm like, oh, my God. And my clothes would be a little bit damp. So, I don't know what was up with that room, but everything was just damp. No idea why. No idea why. You know? Humidity, maybe. I don't know. There was no AC or heat in there. So, just like it felt like it felt outside in there. Who? And I think that's it. Talked about the Airbnb. Loaded up Minecraft. I'm currently loading up the Minecraft boob mod as we speak. I forgot TikTok was still going. Goodbye, TikTok people. Jesus Christ, my eyeliner. Um, I don't normally wear eyeliner, by the way, guys. This is for a stream. Goodbye. See you later. I'm live on Twitch. Meow, 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 meow. Boner reveal win. Oh, it got deleted. Okay. Well, never was going to be the answer to that. So don't ask no stupid shit like that ever again. Don't ask questions you know the answer to, dumbass. Oh, it's going to be funny if I talk about his boner. No, it's not. It's only funny when I talk about my boner, idiot. All right? Know that. Know this. Do you perm your hair? Take your beanie off? No. No. Can we see the tar up? Oh, right, right, right. I guess I should prove that we were hanging. Well, you know, you guys saw the stream with Johnny. I was obviously, we were talking about her coming, you know. No, she was on her way. Unless you guys think I'm fucking lying. So, you know, first of all, she got fucking mogged. First of all, she got absolutely motherfucking mogged. Okay? Look at how mogged she got. I mean, Jesus Christ. <laughs> How are you going to let me outmog you like that, dude? I mean, Jesus. Okay, <laughs> let me get the regular one. That's the regular way. It was after the emo thing. I'm upset I didn't take more pictures. Like, I didn't get any pictures with Nikki. I didn't get any pictures with Tubbo. I didn't get any pictures with Hannah. I didn't get any pictures. I took a selfie with Prezzo. But I didn't, like, get a picture. I didn't take a picture with Chibli. I didn't, let's see, Stand Up Smile. Thank you for the tier one sub. I guess pretty much everyone I met, except for the people I posted. I took a selfie with Austin Show. But holy God, was that the worst one. I'm like, whoa. <laughs> yeah. Like, you thought the other ones were bad. I was like, hey, man, um, everyone says we we sound alike. Bleh. <laughs> yeah. He's probably like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> we won't share it? No. What do you mean you won't share it? That's all this is. Do you like the Stern Leo triplet? I don't know much about the Stern Leo boys, uh, but they seem like cool guys. You know, they seem fun. I think one of them's gay, I think, right? Isn't there a gay triplet? Pump Cheese, thank you for the tier one sub. Breesh. Let me see your nipples. Just go look for the, you know, pictures of me at the stream rewards. The nips were out, brother man. 
Uh, okay, I'm currently loading up the Minecraft boob mod. Let me ask you guys a question. Let me ask you two questions, actually. Do you guys like Minecraft? Follow question, do you guys like boobs? Put those two things together and you have this stream right now. Okay, that's what we're doing. Zombie Ray, thank you for the tier one. Uh, for two months, thank you very much. Um, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I saw a chat I wanted to talk about. But it's gone now. But it's gone now. You look so nice today. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, it's good to be back, people. But damn, was that a fun trip. It was so cool to meet everybody. So cool to meet everybody. And... Yeah, I don't know. Meeting new people. Meeting people I've been fans of forever. Meeting people that I knew online, in person, was dope. You know, collabing, all that good shit. The award ceremony in and of itself was like fucking, you know, fuck the Oscars or whatever. This shit rocked. Like, it was so well put on. Like, I felt like I was some kind of like movie star or something. Oh, is it ad time? My bad. W ad block. I think that would be the sub that you have. Um, but yeah, like it, it was, it was such a well put together show. It was awesome. And, uh, happy to, you know, be a part of it. You know, I think that's probably the end of the line for me, unless I have just an absolutely insano style year that my, I feel like rising star was the main shot. Uh, Nicole, thank you for the tier one sub, but maybe not, you know, maybe I shouldn't sell myself short. Who knows what's going to happen? Thoughts on BBWs, you know what Drake said. I love how all my conversation is like in between sentences. I'll read a chat and like try and come up with something really quick. That's just the kind of guy I am. That's how my brain works. Um, yeah, maybe best breakthrough streamer if something crazy happens. Uh, we'll see. But I was happy to just be a part of it. It was fucking awesome. So, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Dave Emma Andrea. Thank you for the prime sub. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Oh, yeah. I went to the 100 Thieves office. Yeah, that was cool. That was dope. Went over there. They gave me a cool little keyboard. It was awesome. Uh, uh, uh. I was really hoping Queso and Jinxie would be there, but they were not, unfortunately. They met up, though. That was a nuts stream. Only Caleb, thank you for the three months. The official Wayne Johnson, or Dwayne Johnson, big fan. Thank you for the prime sub. Um... Did you talk to AMP? I did not. I, t I mean, Mari, I think, is cool with all them, so I talked to her for a little bit. She was cool. All right, I'm going to piss. Opinion on your nude leaks? I don't think they're out yet, but... I feel like if that ever happened, I just... I mean, what are you going to do? You know, you just got to let it ride. You just got to be like, whatever, you know? Hannah, thank you for the eight months. Appreciate it. There's no point in freaking out at that point, you know? The way he's yet to hop on Minecraft? Oh, interesting that you say that. It's interesting that you say that because... Oh, wait. Hold on. Dumbass. Yeah. Yeah. I hit 199k on Twitch? No way. No way I hit it. I don't want to get my hopes up. I don't want to blue balls myself. No way I hit it on this stream. Balls myself? No way I hit Echo. it on this stream. Hey, yeah. Balls myself? Yeah. No way I hit Echo. it on this stream. Uh. Hey, hold yeah. up. Balls myself? Yeah. No way I hit Echo. it on yeah. this stream. Uh. Hey. hey, hold up. Hey, yup. No way I hit it on this stream. Yup. Hey, uh -huh. hold up. Hey, yup. Hey, yup. 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 Yup.
Let a man live. Let me check my stream manager. Okay, 199. So I would I would need 900. I would need 900 followers right now to get to 200k on this stream, which I don't think will happen. But maybe, perhaps. All right, so I'm gonna piss. I'm gonna piss. What song do you guys want to listen to? Hmm. 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 I don't know why I asked. I'm not gonna take suggestions. <laughs> I'm just gonna play a song. Oh, a new Yeet album happened. I don't know if you guys are big Yeet fans. I'm gonna play this one again. <laughs> I am gonna mute because I, you know, I got a powerful stream. Breathe by Yeet, yes! All right, I saw one chat saying breathe by Yeet, so we're switching. Someone with taste in the chat. Oh, yeah, I am. Well, that kind of ruins it. All right, people. Listen, if you don't enjoy Yeet, then I don't know what to tell you, dude. You don't enjoy true music, okay? You know? Yeet, greater than Taylor Swift. I hate to say it. I hate to say it. I hate to say it. Kid, something. Thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it. Preach. I'll give the sub if you wash your hands. I did. Look at how wet they are. I had something else to say. Mm. I had something else to say. Can't remember, but... Oh, yeah, I remember. So, um... Yeet sucks with his producers and shit? Well, that's, you know, everyone. Any artist, pretty much. Uh, let's see. Gouther, thank you for the one gifted. So, I'm saying when I... Now that we're back. Now that we're back, Braxton, thank you for the prime sub... Oh, yeah, I forgot it's also chat controls the game, so... So you guys can do this shit if you would like to, you know, ruin my time. Or we can just, you know, talk normally, you know? Alpaca is here, thank you for the tier one sub. I think if I remember correctly, I lost most things. But first, let's check these milky memories out, hmm? Diego Pago, thank you for the sub. So, I don't know. Yep, yep. Rising star nominee with this content right here, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, Jesus Christ. What other rising star nominee is doing shit like this, you know? Boing, 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 boing. Maybe that's why I lost, you know? <laughs> Maybe I need to reevaluate myself. Um, but anyways, what I was going to say is that... I am going to get back to doing some awesome shit, ladies and gents. Oh, am I blind? Interesting. Oh, sh Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, we're going to get back to doing awesome shit. It's going to be sweet. We're going to get back to doing awesome shit. It's going to be dope as hell. I have a lot of fun stream shit planned. And it's going to be crazy, bro. And it's going to be motherfucking bonkers, brother. 
It's going to be motherfucking bonkers. Wirehouse looked blown up because it's been blown up a few times, you know. I give it 100 bits. Thoughts on the economy. Um, Food is broke? No, it's not. It's just I don't want people to annoyingly spam, you know. So there's a cool down on everything. What was the question? Good Lord. I'm getting my ass kicked by my own brain right now. Gracie, thank you for the prime sub. What the fuck was the question that I was going to answer? <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, the blown up thing. and Oh, thoughts on the economy. Okay, yeah, I don't know shit about the economy. I took economics and I, I did okay in economics. But that's about it, you know. I don't barely know anything about the economy. Do you ever play Fortnite? I used to, but, you know, it hasn't been my steez as of recently. But yeah, I've got a lot of fun shit planned. This week is going to be very fun, you know, as, you know, the regulars may know. I really only do Minecraft like once a week. So this will be the Minecraft stream for the week. Unless, you know, there's just some incredible demand for Minecraft. Supply and demand. That's some economy shit, dude. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know what's awesome about this boob mod is that they protrude through the diamond armor you know what this looks like hold the fuck on hold on there was a streamer at the streamer awards who had like armor titties oh what was her name hold on what was her name she had like armor boobs it was an awesome dress it was like i don't even know if it counts as a dress it was like a suit of armor hold on oh what is her name everyone is talking about uh, was it Quarter Jade? Is that her name? There's so many people that I like sort of recognized. But, like I I didn't really know no. Yeah. Okay. Are you guys watching this? Watch this. Boom. Okay. See how that's like a suit of armor? Suit of armor breasts. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Art imitates life, so they say. You know what I'm saying? It's the same image. You can't find the difference between these images. You know what I'm saying? Get her on the pod. I don't I don't know much about her. Don't know much about her. Like I was saying, there were a lot of people I recognized that I just didn't know. Let me try and think of what I want to do in this way. I guess I can go mining and just chat with you guys. I'm also gonna give myself a bunch of torches, cause this this mod is fucking these shaders. I'm actually I might turn the shaders off for this one. Low key. I haven't played without shaders in a hot minute. But yeah, there were a lot of people that like I sort of recognized, but like I didn't know what they did. Yo, this looks way less cool. This looks like shit now. Damn. Can we compare them one more time? I was looking at the wrong boobs. <laughs> no. All right, we're not going to do that. You know, there were a lot of, you know, there were some boobs out. I had my boobs out as well for the streamer awards. You know, everyone was kind of rocking the titties out look. It was pretty cool. I was rocking it as well. You know, I wanted to join in on the fun. I wanted to see what all the fuss was about. So. Oh, dude, now the boobs aren't shaded, though. That kind of sucks. <laughs> they actually look funnier. That's hilarious. <sighs> but yeah, unfortunate loss, but happy to be there. Thoughts on the Nikki and Megan beef? It's hilarious. You guys are, <laughs> sometimes I can't tell if this is like a bit, but like I'll get asked questions about stuff that happened forever ago all the time, like the Drake leak stuff. And then the Nikki and Megan beef, I, that was forever ago. I, is that still happening? I have no idea. 
I'll give you, you know, my quick synopsis. Nikki's song sucked wiener, and Megan's song was pretty good. There you go. <laughs> Did you hear about 9-11? Yeah, it's exactly like that. Did you hear about the tragedy? There's this horrible tragedy. I'm not sure if you heard it. Thoughts on the Titanic? I've talked about this recently, but, like, I feel like... <clears throat> Tragedies or like tragic events, they have an expiration date. Not an expiration date, but they have, there's a certain date in which you are allowed to start making jokes about those things. And someone's got to be the first person to do it, you know? Which got to be pretty awkward for that person, the first person to. But like, you know, Titanic, no one is thinking about the victims of Titanic. You know, you could make. Like, when I was in elementary school, we had a slide that was the Titanic. Like, you slid down as if you were... Okay, there's a wither over here. You slid down as if you were, you know, dying in the Titanic. In the same way that my kids might have, you know, maybe like a 9-11 slide or something. I don't know. I don't know. Who's your fave streamer? That's a tough one to answer. I will say I have a lot more people to watch now that I've met people at the Streamer Awards. I like to watch people like, I don't know. Like once you meet people, I'm like, I'm curious what your content is like. My favorite is Queso. Well, I do watch Queso. But you know, I, I gotta pick something a little more niche and different, you know what I'm saying? Wawa, oh yeah. People watch? I people watch all the time. I'll go out to eat, like, alone, just to kind of listen on conversations. And then sometimes it'll be too obvious that I am listening to the conversation. Like, the people will be like, take a look at this floor. And I, and I from a table away, will be like, yo. And they're like, did you just fuck? Are you listening to us? I'm like, oh, shit. My bad, dude. My bad on that. I just like to listen in on what's going on, you know. You can hear some serious tea. Okay, so there's two Ender Dragons over here. If I remember correctly, the Fella Towers got hit. Yeah. So this is where Mine 11 happened. Unfortunately, Mine 11. Mine 11 happened here. May we never forget. May we never forget, dude. Rest in peace to all the lives lost in mine 11. Boing, 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 boing. Oh, that was close. Jesus. Thoughts on medium under boob? I feel like a little tasteful side boob is nice, you know? Just a little bit, just a little tasteful. Side boob is I. Why does Steve moan? Uh oh. Okay, I think I'll be okay. I think I can survive this. I can survive this. I can survive it. It's because I have the gender mod installed. That's why I have big Minecraft breasts, you know? And it makes female pain sounds. You know? That was a perfect impression, actually. Perfect impression. I wish there was like an interview of me that we could react to, but unfortunately, that was either scrapped or it there was some kind of technical error. But the gist is that Will Neff said I was one of the most fashionable people there, and then... Uh, I said that I was worried about my nipples showing and that Dolce & Gabbana doesn't make pasties. So, I just gotta make sure they're clipped. Or not clipped, covered. Sorry. <laughs> trying to find like a mine or something. I'm kind of just gonna run around and chat with ya. Dord, thank you for the two months. I need to get ironed or something. Are you respectful to women? Yeah. Of course, dude. Defish swim, you know? 
kind of question is that? Also, if someone was disrespectful to women, I feel like they would not be like, they wouldn't just be like, no, you know, they would admit to that. So the question is moot. <laughs> yeah, I read feminist literature, dude. Where would you go to learn how to swim? Uh, <clears throat> growing up, my dad was a big, like, advocate for, you know, sink or swim. Like, if you just... Eventually, you're going to fucking learn how... You're going to swim or you're going to die, you know? Like, he would just kind of just throw me in the... Throw me in the... Um, in the water. And if I started to drown, he'd go in there and he'd get me. But eventually, you start to learn. Eventually, you start to learn. They just throw you in, and you start to drown. He's like, I got you. Why do fathers do that? I don't know. Try not to raise, um, you know, a bunch of pussies. Dude, listen to this. Opa Kai, they give it to tier one sub. Liberal ass LA. When I went to LA... You know, the liberals have taken over. They had Obama Street, dude. What's up with that? Obama Street? Are you serious? When is it when is it enough, Los Angeles? What's next? What's next? Transgender Avenue? What's next? Pronoun Boulevard? You know what I'm saying? I mean, Jesus Christ. When is enough enough? <laughs> no, that was a real street, though. Was a real street. Blue haired boulevard. Amen. The gayborhood. Yup. Bro, struggle with that one? Yeah. You know. I mean, you fucking try, dude. You fucking try it. I'm running on three hours of sleep. The bit factory has lost half of its employees. Bisexual Boulevard. Okay, we've got some alliteration going. I like that. I like that. Pronoun town. Okay, you guys are better at this than me. Okay, I get it. Lesbian lane. Yeah. You guys also get time. <laughs> if we're talking like Fortnite maps, you could be like trans towers and shit. Are you hungover? Uh, no. I didn't drink last night. I was hungover yesterday. That was a pretty good stream for being hung over, though. Hey, we found something. Pretty good stream, if I do say so myself. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, I remember what we did on the last one. I was trying to get Emerald so I could trade with the villagers. I remember. I remember. We need more singing. I did kind of go off singing last night. I did kind of go off. Okay, I just have wood. <clears throat> I'm out here in Miami. Look up all the Gucci daddies. <clears throat> so do we have any do we have do we have any streamer award questions or are we done talking about the stream? Are you from LA? No, dude, I'm not from LA. Everyone in LA <clears throat> I will say this. Before I answer your streamer award questions, everyone in LA is an influencer or like an aspiring entertainment person, or they've just grown up there their whole lives. You know, they've either grown up there their whole lives or, you know, they moved there to become an actor or influencer or whatever. Down, 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 down. Are you from Tampa? No. Do streamers fangirl over each other, or is that, like, not cool? You got robbed in the streamer once? Thank you. But, you know, shit happens. She's deserving of it. That was the only one I didn't get to meet. The one that won. I don't know why I'm talking about her. Like, she's like, the one that won. Uh, Nora. Oh! What'd you give up for Lent? Heroin. If you gave up heroin for Lent, you know, I feel like that's like the... You're not exactly a devout Christian if you're like... 
addicted to heroin. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like the people that are like needing to give up heroin, there's there's no way they're participating in Lent. You know? <laughs> yeah, gay sex. <laughs> Giving up gay sex for Lent. Gonna try being straight for a little bit. I gave up Oreos one time. <clears throat> I used to give up shit that I would never like. Like when I was a kid, you know, I participated in Lent. And I would just give up shit that I wouldn't need. You know, I'd be like... Like when I was a kid and participated in Lent, I'd be like, I give up on eating broccoli. My broccoli addiction is getting out of hand. My parents are like, what? I'm like, that's what I'm doing. Giving up on broccoli. So, you know... Giving up on females? Well, you know. I don't think that you're... <laughs> the ultimate loophole. If you're gay, right? Closeted. And you're in the church. And they're like, what do you give up for Lent? You're like... Um, women. Checkmate. I only have one option now. They're like, no! The perfect loophole. <clears throat> Anyways, I've gone on this just... Crazy tangent. Let's see what someone said something about um do people like fangirl over each other in the stream? I not that I saw. I mean oh that was something I want to talk about. You know what um what was interesting is at the stream rewards, the general admission, like whether it be fans or like streamers that weren't on the floor, they were on the upper deck. So in the beginning, before we went into like the award ceremony area, when everyone was just mingling, there was just a balcony where you could just overlook onto the bottom floor like we were like zoo animals or something. Like I'd look up and <laughs> there'd be a shit ton of people just like staring down, you know, I thought they were going to start throwing peanuts at us or something. And um, there was one time, there was one time where... um. One time, pics of you in the Discord? Nice. There was one time where, like, a shit ton of people were looking at me. It was like, I don't know, 10, 15 people staring my way. I was like, yeah. I know. I know. I know. I'm aware of this. Rising Star nominee. And then I turn around and Quackity's behind me. I was like, oh, okay. That makes much more sense. I should have known, you know, that was a little, <laughs> that was a little, um, ambitious of me. <clears throat> did my twin watch the awards? She did. Did indeed. I did get a nice little pop. I got a nice little pop. Got a little nice bit of applause. That was sweet. Aside from you, who is the best dressed? Will there be a Joe Bart Minecraft collab? Uh, check Twitter, bleh, bleh, bleh. There's also been two Joe Bar Minecraft collabs, BT dubs. Um, yeah, Block Wars again, baby. Hold on, there was a question I was going to answer before that. Fuck! No! Shit! God damn it! Um... Oh, the best dress. That's what we're talking about. Um, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. The girl that we just talked about, Quarter Jade. Holy motherfucking shit. 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Holy hell. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Wow. Nice. Uh, Selbit. Selbit was, um,. Well dressed. Um, one of the one of the hidden gems. I can't remember his name. I want to say his name was Deshaun, maybe. Is Selbit's name Selbit because he's celibate? Is that close enough? I guess that's one less syllable, so maybe not. Sean De Black. Yeah. Whoa. I don't know if I like saying his username, dude. I don't know if I'm even allowed to say his username. That feels like, you know, I'm like, Sean, interesting. Well, his name is Dominic. Nice. 
He was well dressed. There was a guy that I talked to for a little bit. I forget his name. He was wearing like a crop top thing. He had a really good outfit. Really good outfit. And then there was a guy. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Who else? Who else was well dressed? Bryce Up, one of my moodies, who I've been in a video with. He was well dressed. <clears throat> Tubbo. Oh, Tubbo. How the fuck did I miss that one? Tubbo? Aw. 400 bits turned my hand into a stick. I lost my torches. Thank you. Fellow, welcome back. Also, you were for sure the best dressed dude. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Tubbo is well dressed. Me and Tubbo both got, we're the Dolce and Gabbana brothers, dude. Next time I come to, you know, I, I know going to the United Kingdom goes against all of my core values, but... I might pop out for the guy. <clears throat> What's your dream car? PT Cruiser. Or as I like to call it, the Pussy Wagon. Um, I drove one of those in high school. Not the Pussy Wagon. So Every time I say the word pussy, I think of that vine of Ludwig being like, do you guys sell pussy or whatever? I can't remember the exact context of it, but do you know what I'm talking about? He's like, do you have any pussy on the menu? It's like an old vine of Ludwig. Anyways. Damn, okay, well now I have... Some of you were asking the objective. I was, you know, just mining. Miner. I mean mining, you know? There we go, Nikki. Now we're in the same boat. Except, you know, I'm doing it 1,700 people. You did it with like a million people or something. How close you are to 200K? I mean, I would assume not that close still. How did you like LA? I liked it. You know, I liked the people, the city, and I liked the places. But like getting to the people in the places was very annoying. Guys, I'm choking help. Oh, what, do you want me to give you the digital Heimlich? Like, what am I supposed to do in this situation? You know? Holy motherfucking God! 15 chains! Thank you for another 10 gifted. Good lordy lord. <laughs> I don't know why I just turned into a lunch lady when you gifted me subs, but thank you very much. Hell yeah, man. Thank you very much. My legs are shaking. Um, your mom when I'm uh your mom when um uh your mom when I'm you get it, you know. Look at this. I don't know if you guys remembered or not, but I am playing the boob mod. Boing 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 boing. How do I make a girl like me? Well, here's the thing, okay? They're going to say that they don't like this thing called mansplaining, but really that's the secret method. They love it. Oh my God, 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Good Lord, 30 gifted from 15 chains. What are you, Jeff Bezos or something, dude? Nice. Thank you, 15 chains. Appreciate it. Good Lord. Thank you. Seen you on TikTok. Say something funny. Well, I've been saying funny shit, you know. You can't just be like, you know, dance, funny man, or whatever. It'll have to come naturally. Much like my, you know, wiener or something. I don't know. That was pretty low-hanging fruit, but it works. But thank you, um, yeah, thank you for the 30 gifted 15 chains and also the, you know, 30 blocks of diamonds. Yup. Yup. Oh my God. When Tara and I were talking yesterday, I feel like I upset her a little bit because I was talking about, um, <laughs> she was talking about her dog and I was like, well, how old is she? She has this like little chihuahua and she was like, you know, how I was like, how old is your dog? And she was like, you know, three. And I was like, okay, well, 
you've got time. You don't have to worry for a while. And she was like, what was that supposed to mean? I was like, well, you know, like you have time as in like, you know, he's not going to like die anytime soon. You know, like my dog got cancer. Why would you say that? Because it's what I thought of immediately. It made sense in the moment. That was my first thought. Because if it was old, it'd be like, okay, well, there's not much time here. I just tell it how it is, bruh. Did you did say sorry? No, I didn't apologize. No, of course I... Well, you know, she knows kind of dicking around. I don't like to apologize for that shit. It's true. Bikini bottomless mimosas. Thank you for the tier one sub. Shit! Double click an item to quick snack it from chess and inventory. Wow. I've been playing Minecraft for a long time. And I don't think I remember that. Is this the fucking end of the cave, bruh? No, it's not. But yeah, going back to the best dress thing, Tubbo was very well dressed. I need to find some iron. That would be hashtag lit. The handsome fella queso collab. Well, you know, the handsome fella queso collab had everything riding on me winning the award. So, you know, since you guys didn't vote enough, I guess it'll never happen. No, I'm kidding. Um, I that's gonna take some sweet time because he didn't know who I was at all. Like when he was watching the streamer award, it's all our fault. Well, you know, I'm not gonna say it's my fault. You know, <laughs> I would never admit to it being my fault. You just passed iron. I got it, bro. Do you know how long the stream is gonna be? I have to go shower. Well. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> just go shower. <laughs> or just watch it in the shower. Apparently people do that. Okay, I got enough shit. I need to take a picture of... Um, the, the, or I need to look at my picture of the cords. <laughs> that, that head of yours is a little big today. You know, it's the... Um, it's LA, dude. It changed me. I realized... I realized... You know what? I am important. <laughs> you know what? It's like I'm a hero. You know, if you think about it, really, streamers are like heroes. Oh, my God, dude. Thank you for 10 more gifted 15 chains. Jesus Christ. 15 chains. What the fuck, man? Good Lord. How much money do you have? I feel bad almost. Damn, man. Thank you. Thank you very much, 15 Chains. Wow. Holy shit. So you're saying LA gave you head. Well, I said it got to my head, but that would be cool too. The city of LA. That would be dope. The entire city of LA. Do you mew? I don't know. Did you see my pictures from this weekend? Of course I fucking mew, dude. Of course I'm mewing and shit. All right. Will you go back to LA? Um, I I feel like I met so many people that live in LA that I want to continue to hang out with. So I, I I don't think I would move to LA. I've always said I'd never move to LA. But then after being there, I'm like maybe. You got a perm asking for a friend? I've said this before, but telling me I have a perm is like saying a slur to me. I do not have a perm. Do you realize how offensive that is to say? Jesus. Did you enjoy hanging out with Jake and Johnny? Yeah. I enjoyed hanging out with everybody. Like everyone that I knew vaguely online and then hung out with in person was so cool. Prezzo is fucking hilarious. Jake and Johnny... Fucking hilarious. Uh, Nikki, Tubbo, fucking hilarious. It's dope. Prezzo was a sweaty girl. Yeah. Prezzo was sweating his ass off, but so was I. 
So <laughs> I was just wearing makeup. You couldn't quite tell until it started to run. Making me cry. Ah. <laughs> you look good, Emo. I should do that again. Yeah, from the stream yesterday, I have, you know, I still have the eyeliner on. And low key. Oh my fucking God, dude. What is happening right now? 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 more gifted. Jesus, man. Damn, dude. Thank you. I keep saying dude, but dude is a gender neutral term. I don't know if that's exactly true, but <laughs> maybe. I do call everyone dude. I feel like some girls are off put when I'm like, dude, what's up? But that's just in my vernacular, bro. Are they using your mom's credit card? 15 Chains, be honest with me. Are you just using your mother's credit card and then she's going to be super pissed? Why do the blue things keep falling? Refer your eyes to the menu on the right-hand side of the screen. And that will answer all. Dude is gender neutral. Can confirm. There you go. I say dude all the fucking time. Yeah, the infinite money glitch. The infinite money glitch. Stealing your parents' credit card. Unlimited money. Forever. 15 chains. I have student loans. Pookie. Hey, I have student loans. Okay. All right. He's going to my student loans, dude. God damn it. Uh, uh, uh. It's the same as saying girl to everyone. I guess that's true. He just really likes the boob mod, yeah. You mean this mod? Yup. It is kind of crazy that at like 18, you know, you're like, hey, you're freshly out of uh, high school, right? You know, you just finished up like pre-cal and stuff. Speak, thank you for the four months. Congrats on the success. Next year, you get an award on Ja. On Ja. I am getting an award. I'm thinking about just doing a category, like I just switch to like chess or some shit, or just start doing art and then have a better shot at those categories, you know? Ooh, Gather, thank you for the five gifted, baby. Yup. Thank you, Gather. Gather's going bam for bam, bruh. Yeah. Come on, everybody, go ban for band. Prove your worth by giving me money. Prove your worth by giving me money. Come on, let's give. Let's play the give. Hands up, the money game. <laughs> VTuber, but it's hyper realistic. Oh, what if I did that? Try and win best VTuber. No, I'd be fucked. There's no. Those people are like doing unbelievable numbies. First time conscious stream. Good to have you, bruh. Should be getting close to my cribby wib. It is hilarious that the VTubers are like there on iPads. <laughs> Did you see the clip where Austin knocked over Iron Mouse's like iPad? He's like, Austin fucking kills Iron Mouse. <laughs> do you know family friendly YouTube channel? I do. I, I collabed with uh, me and Berserk were in a video one time. I like their stuff. Creative shit. Dude, my house has got to be somewhere over here. Your PC build? Um, you know how it's like, <laughs> instead of liquid coolant, it's just cum. Do you know how hard I have to work to power this PC? I've got a team of like seven dudes. <laughs> and it's tough, you know? It's pretty difficult. No. Uh, it's not powered by com. It's uh, 4900 NVIDIA something. Um, 64 gigs of DDR5 RAM, which apparently is important. Um, uh, I did a setup video one time. You can check it out. Noah Miller, deadass warrior outfit, but he didn't serve. Did I outserve a gay man? 
That's always a pretty satisfying feeling if you outserve the gays, you know? Beat them at their own game. <laughs> I saw clips of Austin Show saying he wished he had worn my outfit. And I was like, um, yeah. That's right. Beat you at your own game, dude. I'm wearing lace now. Straight man takeover. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Um, I know in in Mills is like a TikTok icon person. Their videos still come up on my for you page. Boing, boing, boing. Ah, stray boy summer. 200k tonight? Doubtful. Maybe. You look like my friend Jake. Was well, your friend Jake sexy as hell? I hope you're like an adult. Oh, holy shit. 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Wow. Oh my god. Okay, well that kind of ruined the moment. 15 chains. That's like 60 gifted, dude. Good lord. Uh, I gotta do some research on 15 chains. Thank you. Start making BF. Start making boyfriend ASMR. I think I'd rather die. Um, yo, what if it's Mr. Beast? Hold on. 15 chains... Are you Mr. Beast? 15 chains. Are you Mr. Beast? Something tells me you're Mr. Beast. Hmm. Something's telling me you're Mr. Beast. Oh, dude, I got hella feastables, bruh. I got hella feastables. Um, from the uh, stream rewards. They're all over the place. <laughs> gift 50 more if you're Mr. Beast. <laughs> if you're the real Mr. Beast, you would give more. No, thank you, 15 chains. That's fucking nuts. Yeah, Mr. Breast. I didn't realize how much 50 subs is. Dude, I didn't realize how much subs were until I started gifting them myself. And I was like, holy Jesus, man. Puts it in perspective. Thank you, 15 chains. You could have like, I don't know, 25 chains. Have you? Had you not gifted all those subs? Oh my God! Jesus Christ, 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 more gifted. Hold on. We got to get to the bottom of this. You're Mr. Beast. You're Mr. Beast. You're Mr. Beast. I know you are. It's got to be Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast confirmed. Who's 15 Chains? 15 Chains is the person that has gifted... What, 70 subs at this point? You're either Mr. Beast or your dad owns like a tech company or something. Handsome fellow, you're wearing eyeliner. All right, you got to refer to the stream yesterday for that to make sense. I got to go into work tomorrow with a little bit of eyeliner. And now they're going to be like, why is your eye a little black? And I'm like, shh, shut up. Oop, oop, oop. Look at his chat history. Ooh. Oh my fucking God, dude. What is happening right now? Uh, what is happening right now? 15 chains. Who is this mysterious person? Fifteen chains has only typed in the chat. Tonight and on November 5th. Is it Mr. Beast? No, I don't think it's Mr. Beast. But holy shit, thank you. You're turning around? Yeah, I'm getting horny for all this money. And when I get horny, I get red. No. Um, contact dermatitis. But thank you. Wow, dude. That's such a responsible monetary decision. It is. Imagine it's your mom. Well, 
Now I know it's not, you know, I know it's not my mom. We hit 70 gifted. That's not my fucking mom, dude. The same mom that would, you know, tell me we had, um, you know, wouldn't let me go to McDonald's. She's like, we have food at home. Not my mom. <laughs> Kids in Africa who can't watch Anson Fella. See, that's the saddest part about the shit. Blah, 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 blah. 15 Chains sent a little emote. Well, thank you very much, 15 Chains. That is very um, generous of you. I appreciate it. You do not have to do that. Um, but I appreciate it. One ninety nine point one. What? I'm in a hundred and ninety nine k. I got nine hundred followers in the last thirty minutes. Are you fucking serious? No way. I didn't mean to close out Minecraft. That was an accident. You got to be pulling my dick. You got to be pulling my dick. You can say that again. Got to be pulling my dick. You can say that again. You got to be pulling my dick. Got to be pulling my dick. You can say that again. You got to be pulling my dick. Got to be pulling my dick. You can say that again. Okay, I'm done <laughs> doing that bit. Oh, Jesus Christ. 15 chains, what the fuck is happening right now? Why do you have so much money? You're freaking me out, dude. What is happening right now, brother man? Holy Jesus. God damn, dude. What is happening at this point in time right now? 50 Chains, thank you for the gifted subs. Good God. Thank you for that raid. Um, what is that, 80? 90? I can't even keep up. Good googly moogly. Got me over here like... Oh, shit. That's a lot of money, bruh. You know? Dude, I'm telling you guys. LA. All that screen time. Now I'm making big bucks. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me check the... Uh, what are we at right now? 199.2. That is fascinating. Holy shit. God damn. Okay, let me get back to the Minecraft boob mod. All right, we got... I accidentally closed the uh, the app because I was so, you know, giddy with excitement for the gifted subs. Handsome fella, LLC to the moon, motherfuckers! Yup! Thank you, guys. All right, well, now you just ruined the moment. Do you have sex with the bear? No, dude. Let me enjoy this. <laughs> I'm trying to be sentimental right now. Subathon coming soon. 200K is crazy. I remember when I hit 100K, I was freaking out. Um, dude, hitting 200K right after the stream rewards? That's kind of nuts, man. That's kind of nuts, so. I mean, 200K might happen tonight. It might. I remember when you hit 100K, it doesn't seem that long ago. It wasn't that long ago. Um, I hit 100K at... Uh, when was it? It was either late October or early November, I think. Is when I hit 100K. I think. Maybe it was November. Your outfit was... Is that an orange emoji? What does that mean? Your outfit was tangerine? Oh, it's fire? Okay. <laughs> From where I sit, it looked like an orange. I got to change my context again. Um, well, you guys know what happens to 200K. It's the oiled up twerk stream or whatever. All right. Um, maybe this will incentivize people to follow more. Boing, 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 boing. You know? Are you guys picking up what I'm putting down? I guess the other room would be like the furthest room, maybe. 
I don't know. I've lost so much shit on this world. My biggest regret is, uh, uh oh. All right, well, at least now I can get a good look at fellow towers. Mine 11, may we never forget. Do you know Nut from YouTube? I do. I like Nut. I mainly just see Nut in like, like featured on other, other channels. La da 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 da. Opinions on the potato famine? Well, us in America, we don't have to deal with that bullshit, dude. First of all, I mean, a potato fam, it's like, just don't, okay, whatever. I don't have to eat potatoes now. So what, you know? Was that just because, was that just because the Irish just eat a ton of potatoes? Or was that because there was like a, like a potato virus that wiped out all the potatoes? Opinions on Big Puffer? We're in a, um, we're on a team for a Block Wars event coming up. Anyone at work know about these streams? Um, an old couple figured out about it recently. Not an old, an old couple. They're not like elderly, but they're like adults, you know, like 40s. They were like, do you make TikToks? I was like, oh, fuck, dude. Yeah. And then this guy was like, dude, I loved your clip of the, uh, the shirt that said fungal jungle. And then it pointed down low. I was like, um... <laughs> Thanks, I guess, you know, so we have a whole new demographic, people, you know what I'm saying? We have a whole new demographic. I'm appealing to a wide range of age demographics, um, you know, so there you go. Smelting the iron. I went to a karaoke bar with Jake and his ass would not do karaoke. I was like, come on, bruh, come on, bruh. Back in my room now. Good to hear it, Evan. Because I want to do no scrubs. No one wants to see me in karaoke, dude. I got range, sister. Oh my god, 15 chains. What is happening right now? Is that 80 gifted? I guess I can see. They've gifted a total of 100. I think there's been 80 tonight. What is happening right now? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Whew. Good. Good gracious. He's stressed? Yeah, I, I feel bad is what I feel, you know? I feel bad that I'm either taking this guy's money or... This guy's parents are going to be pissed in the morning when they check their credit card statement. They're going to be like, yo. Um, <laughs> shut up, you love it? Oh, I mean, of course. You know, who doesn't love money? I'm just saying, you know, I'm not going to act like... <laughs> I'm not going to act like I don't love money, but, you know, I, I, a part of me feels, you know, at a certain point, it's like, I, f I feel bad, you know, that's so gracious. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Pick a number one through 36. Um, 17, 18, 18, we're going 18, we're locking in 18, actually. Uh, and we're gonna make a shield, and we're gonna make a shield. And I fucked that shit up. Ba boom. Then I don't know now. Thoughts on the Fortnite song? Oh yeah, that guy performed. I mean, that was legendary to see the you know classic chug chug jug with you live. No. Okay, I guess not. He looks so happy to be there. I was. Height confirmed. Yeah, dude. Um, I'm not as short as motherfuckers say that I am, you know? You know, you guys saw me walking around looking tall. 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What's this room going to be? I don't even know. I'm, I am I might go back to my villager trading place and do some village shit. You had D&G shoe heighteners? I did not. I, I thought about getting the platform ones, but didn't do it. Hansavell is an alien. He uses to mind control to get subs very fast. Ooh. You saw right through my secret plan. I'm like, you will give me money. You will give me money. Yo, your TikToks are so funny. Do something funny right now. I fucking hate those comments. <laughs> you know how hard it is to be funny when someone's like, Oh, you're funny, funny man? Why don't you tell me a joke? And I'm like, fuck! Oh, Jesus Christ. I just thought of something funny um, on the topic of Mr. Beast. It must be exhausting to be Mr. Beast. Like, it must be so exhausting to be Mr. Beast because every person you ever run into will just be like, hey man, um, you know, I'm kind of going through a hard time right now. Can I have some money and stuff? Can I have a thousand dollars? Because a thousand dollars is like that's like a couple pennies to Mr. Beast. Does my height if you Google my height, does it say six seven? Fuck yeah. Well that's completely accurate. So so, 199.3k. Okay, I don't think we're going to hit it this stream. <laughs> I don't know. If we're, I think that's pretty advantageous. I guess we did get... Did we hit... Were we at 198k at the start of the stream? Or were we at 190? I can't remember. Oh, fuck me. 20 ads is crazy. Um, lying is crazy. Being a dirty little liar. How many subs to act like a rotisserie chicken and spin in an air fryer? I don't know. I don't know if I'm comfortable doing that. Real voice reveal at 200k? Yeah. Well, you guys know my real voice. This is all just an act I put on. Oh, this is me. This is me. Who do you think you would beat in a fight? Just like in general? Um, let me think of somebody. Who could I beat in a fight? Just anyone? Hmm. 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 <laughs> I mean, I feel like, I feel like, oh my God, 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 more gifted. Yeah. Joe Biden is a good answer. Joe Biden. I could beat Joe Biden up. I bet. Dude. Thank you for the 10 gifted, dude. Holy shit. What is happening right now? What is happening? Ah! Fuck! Thank you very much. You're the best. You should play some Garfield Kart. I have a bunch of shit planned for this week. I'm going to play the new Demon game or some shit. Whatever the fuck that's. I've seen a lot of pop about it on Twitter. I don't really know what it is. Either he's super rich or his parents are going to be pissed. Yeah, it's one of the two, you know. It's either this guy is Mr. Beast or his parents are going to be very upset. Gowther, thank you for the 10 gifted. Oh, my God, they're going band for band. They're going band for band in the chat. Jesus Christ, they're going band for band. Good Lord, they're going band for band. It's like a subathon or some shit. What boxer do you think you could beat in a fight? Uh, no boxers at all. <laughs> like, literally none. None at all. People that are like, dude, I could totally beat up, you know, 
the worst. The worst boxer would beat your fucking ass. I can't even talk about anything. This is the craziest shit ever. Uh, thank you, 15 Chains, for the 10 more gifted. Wow. Good lord. Jacob, thank you for the tier one sub. Damn, they're going band for band. They're going band for band. I will say, this is... Thank you for the 10 more gifted. That's insane. Good lord. No way they do it again. No way it happens again, you know. <laughs> I'm just going to lean into it. I was going to say something. <clears throat> At this point, you need to block him. <laughs> well, no, dude. I got to cover the Ubers that I did in the... Uh, the Ubers that I took in LA. Uber is fucking ass in LA. Like... To get to and from anywhere is a hundred bucks. You go fifty dollars to get somewhere, and then you go fifty dollars back to the hotel. And you're like, God damn. Alright, these guys are kind of doing their little moans in my ear. I need to uh oh. No, 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 no. You stay in there. How is your voice so deep? Um I made a deal with the devil. I took off a couple inches. <laughs> I made a deal with the devil, you know. That if I lose, you know, three inches, I could have a, vo a deep voice. Yeah, now it's just a, like, Harvey Weinstein, you know, kind of down there. Well, that's a very niche reference. Not a lot of you guys are going to understand that. <laughs> Not a lot of you guys are going to get that. No, the real answer is Newports. Oh my god, 15 chains. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, 15 chains. Okay. So at this point, here's what I'm assuming at this point. At this, at this point, I'm assuming, first of all, if you're in here and you didn't get a sub... You got to be a little bit pissed. You're like, statistically, I should have a sub at this point. Secondly, um, this is either... Somebody's either making a YouTube video or they're loaded. This is like a secret person making a YouTube video or they're loaded or they got access to their parents' credit card. Very pissed. Well, it's luck of the draw, people. So, I don't know. You never know. This could be like Mr. Beast and it's like giving away, you know, a $1,000 to streamers or something. Right? Hmm? Vibin'. <laughs> it says 15 chains. It's vibin'. You know. Just straight vibin'. Coffee or tea? Well, I am, you know... Not British, so I don't really drink tea. I feel like that's more of a British thing to go get tea. I'm a black coffee man. I like my coffee, I like my women. You know what I'm saying? Shout out the, you know, melanin mommies or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Brother. Yup. White people, when they compliment a black girl's hair, they're like, oh, I did my part. Yup. Uh-huh. Yup. Uh-huh. Have you guys seen that video? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> oh, my God. The weather. Fuck. Fuck. Um, apparently Tara is Persian, and I didn't know that, and I said something about her being white or something, and she was like, what? And I was like, 
Are you not? So she was like, <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, you're Persian. I thought you were straight or something. No. no. She doesn't hate me. I was cool, dude. I'm fucking the king of charm, okay? I'm the king of charm. I'm the king of charm and wit. You know? I didn't know she was Persian. And, and, uh, Nikki taught me some German. She's like German. Yeah, it's Iran now. And apparently there's a word, well, there's a common name in Iran that is a slur, uh, in America, right? So sometimes, you know, people are, People from America will hear that and they'll be like, yo, you're canceled. And they're like, what? That is my name. I mean, it's not the exact like, but it, it's the, it sounds similar. Do you guys think I'm going to fucking say? No, Jesus Christ. What do you, do you guys think I'm insane? Do you guys think I'm a crazy person? No, I'm not going to say it. It's like a name and like a verb. Anyways. How am I on thin ice? That's just like the, uh, that's like just a factual statement that one in this country isn't and one in this country is. That's straight up just like what it is. You know what I'm saying? Anyways. Do 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 do. No, that was the um in the I run language, not that was unrelated to the Nikki thing. Nikki taught me some German, a little bit of German. Dude, the cranking what <laughs> oh dude, we talked so listen to this shit. So the I know two words in German. I know cranking wagon which means ambulance. Which, first of all, that's fucking insane. Why the hell are you calling an ambulance a cranking wagon? And then, they just have goofy-ass names for stuff. And then, the uh, hospital is a cranking house. And then, to, like, be sick or, like, get injured or something is to be crunk. And I was like, well, where I come from... Crunk means drunk on Christ. When I grew up, that's what we said. We were like in youth group, we'd be like, crunk, you know? But in German, that just means you're sick. So it's like, you know. <laughs> oh, shit. 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted again. Good Lord. Good Lord. Good Lord. Brother man, start crying. If I cry, we we gift more subs. Like. I really need it. I didn't know how I was gonna pay these Ubers off from LA trip. <laughs> mm. No, it's for real though. I'm very grateful. Thank you. I appreciate it. That is awesome. That is awesome. I had the sack. Have a good stream. It was good seeing you again. Hell yeah, Evan. Good seeing you, bruh, bruh. 199. Why did your character moan? Because I have... Look at this. Switch genders, bruh. So you have the female hurt sounds. The point of this game... Well, I was trying to... Why the fuck do you have tits? Um, because I love tits. And I love Minecraft. I mean, what? What kind of question is that? So, originally the plan was to trade with this guy for um, wheat, or for emeralds with wheat, 
But then I realized I didn't have any wheat, and then I kind of got um, sidetracked with all the gifted subs. Yeah, 199.3. I don't. I don't think we're gonna hit 200k tonight. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna happen. Did I say weed? I meant to say wheat. Your sword flew, my brother. I know. I don't really need it. I mean, maybe if I were making the stream go for a long time, we'd hit it. I just, I don't know how long I can go tonight. Baby bruh. I do want to make a little Fletcher guy. How the fuck do you make those things? Aren't you tired? I am tired. I'm quite tired. But, want to pop in, give you guys a little update. How do you make a fletching table? What? How does that make any sense? Why? So I can trade with villagers and get emeralds. And then, look at this. And then look at this. Well, look at this first. And then look at this. Get your ass up, bro. But what? I'm gonna shit my fucking pants. This was efficiency five at one point. What the fuck, dude? This was efficiency five. Now it's prot one. That sucks dick. Hands of Elathon four. Yeah, man. Hands of Elathon four. Coming to a stream near you, man. Wake your ass up, cause it's time to go beast mode. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Me, the morning after a one night stand. Wake your ass up, cause it's time to go beast mode. Wow, 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 wow. She's like, what? I'm like, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> that would be, that would be hilarious. She comes again. <laughs> She's like, that was the hottest thing I've ever seen. Girl one? I don't know, dude. I'm running on like very little sleep. In my head, that was funny. 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted again. God. I mean, that's fucking nuts. I'm... I can't even like be like, whoa, because I can't be like, whoa, every time, you know? That's crazy. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. That is so nuts. Isn't it crazy we say things are nuts, but we never say that they're balls? Like, we say things are nuts, but we're never like, that's balls. I guess we do in the sense that, like, if they do something like, um, you know, brave, you're like, that's balls. Like, if you see something crazy, you're like, you're never like, that's balls. Dude, you're balls, you know? I mean, I say things are ball. No, I say balls if, if someone says something brave. If they do something brave, I'm like, that's balls. That takes balls, dude. Also, I hate how you can't say cunt on the internet anymore. You just can't. I can't put it in a TikTok. I can't put it in a YouTube video. I just can't at all. I mean, I can on like a stream, but like to put in like content. I just can't. It's unfortunate, you know? I feel like that's such a fun word. But it sounds very aggressive. I need flint. That's what I was doing. But it honestly has a little bit less of an edge to it now that, you know, the LGBTQIA community has kind of taken cunt under their wing. And they'll be like, that's cunt, you know? They say it in the UK and Australia, yeah. But in America, it's more like a term of endearment for uh, 
you know. The community. I don't know why I said the community as if I'm a part of the community. I guess I'm the A. Is the A ally or asexual? What is the A? You should have won most likely to become a big streamer. Rising star as well. Is, or is the A stand for awesome? Oh, it's asexual? It's not an ally? What the fuck? I thought ally was in there. Oh, it's for any of them? Okay, well, that's just confusing at that point. It's for awesome sauce. Why would ally be in there? I don't know, man. I want a piece of the pie, dude. I want a piece of the pie. I want a piece of the pie. Well, they added stuff, like, after, you know? I mean, I usually say the full thing, but they added stuff. It's not like they just made stuff. I'm just saying to, like, the specific, like, phrase, they added stuff. Why is there no, like, gravel anywhere? <laughs> Ally Pride Month. <laughs> Can we get some ally pride? What was the point I was making, though? Oh, yeah, the cunt thing. Because, like, you know... If two straight people are calling each other cunt, then it's usually like, you know... They're mad at each other. But the gay guys are like... You're cunt. You're cunting, you know? Then, it's like a term of endearment. And, like, the anger, the, like, more aggressive it is, the, like, more of a term of endearment it is, you know? Okay, is there any more gravel? It's first day in stream and you're sexier than your TikToks. Yeah, man. That's how it goes. Wouldn't it be worse if I was uglier, you know? If I wasn't as sexy? Also... Introducing myself. Okay, here's something I want to talk about while I was in LA. So, I got introduced to people every once in a while as handsome, like instead of fella or my first name. And I was, and you know, most people don't know me. So, you know, somebody that doesn't know me, and they're like, this is handsome. And they're like, excuse me. And I'm like, god damn it. I'm going to have to explain this. <laughs> They're like, you're what, dude? I'm like, listen, let me explain this. You did this to yourself? Yeah. I know. But I mean, my name looked pretty sweet up there on the screen, you know? Every time they say it, I'm like, <laughs> you really think so? <laughs> you really think so? Really? Why did you wear such a slutty shirt to the streamer awards? I helped you out there. You said Twitch, but you meant streamer awards. Um, because Dolce & Gabbana convinced me to, and I'm glad they did. Like, when I first put it on, I was like, hell fucking nah, dude. No way. And then I was like, wait a second. This kind of rocks. Oh, it was dope. I got a lot of high school boys being like, so what, you're gay now? So what, are you just gay or something? <laughs> I got a few of those, but other than that. And most people thought the uh, the fits were awesome. Um, I saw maybe one or two people be like clashing. It clashes and it's like, um, what do you know about fashion, idiot? You know? <laughs> I say as if this is not my first time wearing designer ever. My suit before that was um, $150 was my most expensive suit up until that point. So... Where was Jinxie? He was... Not there. 
You know, I don't know where specifically he was. I think he lives in Florida. How did that work? Did you have to give the clothes back? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I didn't buy the... Hell no, nah, dude. Hell no. That shit was like 10 grand. Um... Bro made a fletching table? Yeah, that was the game plan here. Will any of you guys become- Yeah! Fuck yeah, bruh. Sticks. Now I need to get sticks. Thoughts on sketch. Don't know who that is. Well, actually, he's doing something with Jinxie tonight, I think. The name sounds familiar. Molly's tired. Thank you for the prime. Subaruni. Thank you. Who's your favorite streamer there? That's tough to... Tough to answer. Queso knows who you are now? Oh, yeah, he does. Thank you. Shout out to Stream Rewards, dude. Oh, yeah, I think I was trying to make this point, and then I didn't finish my thought. Um, Aaliyah Sweeta, thank you for one gifted. I thought he might see me and be like, yo, I've seen his clips. But I also think that about everybody. Um, and I'm usually wrong, but... Yeah, I was, again, wrong with this. He was like, everybody saying handsome. Is it going to be handsome? And then, it was not me. Immediately after saying that. I'm kind of like this open concept that we created with all the creepers. The love on the internet was dope, though. Like, see, and again, it might just be because I'm in my own little, like, circle jerk bubble. You know, like, I only see the people that like my stuff or, like, people, you know, like, stuff I, the communities I share. So, you know, I'm kind of in, like, a, uh, what's the word? What's the word? What's the word? What's the word? Vacuum, maybe? But I, from what I saw, like, everyone was really supportive after the fact. It was sweet. Um, speech leak. Thoughts on hot dog? Why did I say like that? Jesus Christ. Echo chamber, yes. Echo chamber. Edging chamber. That would be sweet. Hot dog. Um, I used to, I always boiled my hot dogs. That was like the thing. When I was a kid. QT is reacting to the award and saw you vibing with Harry Mack. It was awesome. Fuck yeah, bro. Fuck yeah, bruh. Yeah, we were vibing. Harry Mack. I didn't realize all that was a freestyle until, you know, he was halfway through. Like, halfway to me. I was like, holy shit, he's talking about stuff that's happening right now. <laughs> I was like, yo, look at that. Queso was just hungry. Yeah. You know, classic queso. You know what I'm saying? Uh, your stream rewards fit had me frothing at the mouth. Yep. I kind of have that effect on people, you know? They get rabies. <laughs> they get rabies. Can humans get rabies? You should try doing a Fortnite stream with Joe Bart. I'm doing a Minecraft stream with Joe Bart. And Pezzy. And Big Puffer. Sneak Snag. When you wink to the camera, I fan it. Dude, the, um... I don't... I guess all the mewing and you jelking and, you know... You know, fucking... Jawline maxing and whatever the fuck... Has been working. Because for some reason on that camera angle, when I, like, did that blow kiss thing... It looked like... You know, I was... Like on like some kind of like serious cut for like the UFC or something. It was just all like you know. I was mogging. <sighs> oh yeah, I've been taking Ozempic. It might be the Ozempic. Apparently everyone in LA in LA. Oh my god, I'm a motherfucking idiot! Fuck! Motherfucker! 
fucking shit. Fuck me in the ass. I went up there to get wood and I forgot. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. For six. Yeah, exactly. Yup. I mean, I don't know what Ozempic does, but apparently it just makes you skinny as hell. Break the dead shrubs for sticks? Maybe. I had a point I was going to make. I can't remember. I, I did. <laughs> when it gets late like this, and you know, I'm, the ADHD is creeping back in, it becomes hard to finish thoughts. But yeah, Queso is at least aware of my existence now, which is pretty dope. Um, that bit of screen time was pretty sweet. I I feel like I kind of overdid it with the. I felt like I was doing a lot of stuff. Um, I think it turned out well, but I feel like I kind of was the only dickhead being like, ha 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 ha, oh, whoa, you know. But I just wanted to make the most of my screen time. Um, did you shit in your bed? Why is it brown? Um, yeah. I mean, I pretty much shit in my bed this weekend. The toilet was five feet away from the bed. So it's almost as if I shit in my bed. I think I lost all my wood. No, I didn't. Not quite. I lost a lot of it, though. Um. How nervous were you? Um I was not nervous at all until um it was like right when they announced it. Um Bamboo makes sticks. Are you fucking crazy? Is that real? Hmm. Um, lost all your wood happens to me whenever I, whenever I forget to screw mine on in the morning. It also happens with old age, I guess, you know. That's the saddest part about getting older is your wiener stops working. But luck, well. <laughs> nah. Nah. Won't spoil anything. Won't spoil anything. We will keep moving. I thought I had a bunch of bamboo. Bamboo makes sticks? Was that person fucking with me? Does bamboo make sticks? What is the house? It's been blown up. How the fuck do you make... Sticks with bamboo. I just saw it. I saw it with wood. Oh. Listen, guys. I never claim to be a Minecraft streamer, right? I'm a variety guy. That's my thing. Is variety streaming. Mm. Fucking mustache grows so fast now. Stream schedule when? I'm working on it. <clears throat> I'll probably send one out tomorrow. It says Minecraft Heartthrob in the Twitch caption. I need to change that. Because I feel like I only play Minecraft once a week. Now. Just a good one to talk to the chat with, you know. Is the boob mod on? I mean, you tell me. Yup. 
Oh yeah, I forgot about Poppy Playtime. That fucking sucked dick. That was awful. That took forever, dude. When are you playing Detroit Become Human? Not sure yet. Figure out the schedule soon. Mm -mm -mm. That looks painful for her. Yeah. I've talked about this before, you know, but I just feel like if you have big giant boobs and you get a breast reduction, you're kind of doing the world a disservice, you know? It's like, okay, you have back pain, but think about how selfish that is, okay? Think about me, right? Think about how selfish that is, you know what I'm saying? Gracie, thank you for the raid. Appreciate it. Breesh. Yeah, I guess if you're going to get a breast reduction, send <laughs> over the excess. I've asked this before. What do they do with that? Did they repurpose it and make butter or something? Or like, I don't know. Surely they don't make butter. But, you know, like, is there just a stash of it somewhere? Or do they throw it away? Oh my god. Freeze dry and make a candy. That makes sense. Chamoy pickle. Ray, thank you for the two months. Yup. Alright, I'm gonna have to redo all this shit. Come here, you bastard. Ooh, Infinity is a good one. And I didn't bring my fucking books. God. Fuck me. Alright, I have books up there. This is not cheating. Really, you know, it's not really cheating. Right. Existential something. Thank you for the four months. Breesh. Yup. Infinity. Infinity book. I don't have enough iron for anvils, even. What's the thoughts on Amish people? Um, I mean, I've talked about it a lot. It makes me... I mean, you've all kind of explained it to me, but I refuse to believe that shit. 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 gifted. Holy hell. Thank you very much. Oh, my fuck. Thank you. Welcome back. Welcome back. We missed you. You know? We missed you. I think that's 100. Is that 100? Good lord. Thank you very much. Had to, uh... <laughs> you know... Extend the credit extend the credit limit. Wow. Thank you. Bro, what is this mod? I feel like it's pretty self explanatory. Wanna trade social security numbers? Yeah, man, sure. Sure thing. I trust you. Infinity is a shit trade for you right now? I think it's a pretty damn good one. I'm building out a catalog, goddammit. Is it okay to tug to the stream? You know, just don't tell me what you're doing. Then you can, you know, to your heart's content, I guess. What was I talking about? Amish people. I think Amish people are fascinating. Um, uh, Cause like I'll see them in grocery stores, and they'll get in cars and they'll be on phones, and I'm like, that's fucking crazy. I thought you guys were like, you know, not cool with that stuff, you know? I thought electricity was the devil. Yeah, no, you're gonna ruin the illusion by being like, that's a Mennonite, but eh, I refuse to believe Mennonites exist. And they buy butter, and they should be churning butter. And also, I will choose to remain ignorant on Amish people, because it's funny to think that they're cheating by going to the grocery store. <laughs> Who's the person that won the Rising Star Award? Nora Explorer. Um... How do they know what's going on in the world? If they have a phone or 
if they don't have a phone or like access to the internet, I guess they can get a newspaper. They're still in society in a sense, so I guess they do. Ignorance is about choice. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> what up, Sylvie? I choose to remain ignorant because it's funnier that way, you know? If I just don't know and I'm talking about the Amish, kind of hilarious. But yeah, they like, how do they know about stuff? Do they send texts via carrier pigeon? Um, what's another thing? Horse and carriage. I used to see Amish people on horse and carriage on the road all the time. Car accident, you're fucking dead. You're dead as hell. Do they have horse insurance? Is that a thing that exists? Um, Rumspringer. You can leave and then party your fucking balls off and then go back, you know? You leave the faith and you're like, I'm going to get a phone and a prostitute or something. Yup. And then you can decide to come back. I guess. I misspelled my name. Why me? I mean, I don't... That's like literally the only thing that... Like, you misspelled your name and your username? That's like the word you know the best. Zalia, hey. Thank you for the six months. I'm going to name my kid Restaurant so he always knows how to spell that word. Because that word ruins me every time. I just want him to be better than me. I'm naming my kid Restaurant. So that way he'll just... <laughs> Always know. Bard again, thank you for the tier one. Next time you write, we should write someone less than 10 viewers. That'd be sweet. Ever bury yourself and pretend you're a carrot? I've not. I could see how that would be fun, though. Let's check out some Mo Trades, low key. There are some names that are illegal to name your kid, you know. Like, you couldn't name your kid, like, you know, a certain dictator, right? Like, you couldn't name your kid that guy. I don't think, you know, I think someone tried to do that. And didn't go over very well. What if you named your kid... I might name my kid a name with no vowels, just to see people struggle to say their name. You know, they're like, what's up? What's up? That's hilarious. Oh. Beatbox name. Yeah, they just have to beatbox. That's awesome. Are you having a stroke? Did you not listen to the setup to that? I guess people would probably say that if, you know, that's what you name your kid. They're like, excuse me? What is his name? Do you need to go to the hospital? Naming my kid Mr. Beast. <laughs> that would be awesome. I'm naming my kid Mr. Beast. All right. Um, let's see if I can get this guy a good trade. Do you support gay rights? Like, sometimes questions are asked, and I'm like, is that just like a play to like get a reaction or do you just think I'm a bad person you know or are you just like this will be funny if he said something fucked up I will say it is kind of interesting to think about like um like and I've talked about this before too but like the legislation like I just don't understand how the board meeting was going in you know congress like how was the American government I just don't understand how that meeting went where they're like you know they can't get married because, you know, ew, dude, no way. Don't they get married? What? No, it's not like gay people didn't exist. Uh-oh. Oh, my God, this guy's going to escape. No. 
It's not like they were outlawing gay people. So, like, and, like, I just don't understand what could be the logical, like, like, what could that meeting have possibly entailed? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what justification could possibly exist, like, legally, you know? Your bro despawned? Huh? What you mean about that, bro? I understand it's, like, a religious thing, I guess. It was rooted in religion, but, like... Are they just, like, because of the Bible? But then the politics... I don't know. That was supposed to be a funny bit. I guess we're getting into... I just don't understand. I'm, I'm just assuming they were like, um, no. They, like, do it in the butt and stuff. No way. Oh, did that creeper blow up my lectern and it's gone? That is crazy. Like... What in the world? Would you rather watch a tree go? <laughs> Would you rather come up with an original comment? Or get fucking timed out? <laughs> Motherfucker, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Come on, bruh. You think I'm stupid? All right. You think I'm a fool? Dumbass? Alright, I guess that'll be it. I was gonna trade I was gonna do a awesome trade with the villager, but then my lectern exploded. You traded with the villager, you can't change the villager's trade now. Oh That's how that works, I see. Yeah, it's too dude, I did not mean to stream this long. Damn. Oh my god, 15 chains. Thank you for the 10 more gifted. Jesus. Thank you very much. That's so many gifted. That's unbelievable. God damn. That is nuts. Thank you. Mm. Thank you, truly. That is that is like absolutely insane. Make a wish quick. It's 11-11. Okay. I wish to end world hunger. That's what I did. What did you wish for? Probably something selfish. Probably something selfish. No, of course I didn't wish for that. You know. I can't tell you the wish, the actual wish, or it's not going to come true. So, here we... Uh